Oh. Hey. Hello. Hello. Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Saving Throw. Your voice is super sexy. I know. Oh, I, I was screaming a lot last night, and it's oh. real bad right now. Oh but gosh. I'm going to roll with it today. Roll with it. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome like to Saving dice. Throw. Uh, this is our Valentine's Day special, uh, where we, uh, the, the fine folks at uh, Old Spice released their own character class for the Pathfinder system. Uh, the gentleman, gentle lady, gentle person character class. Mm -hmm. and they were nice enough to... Uh, allow us to do this little game where several of our people will be playing the gentle person themselves. <laughs> so why don't we go around the table and introduce everyone here, uh, starting on this side of me. Hi, my name is Jordan Caves Callerman, and I'll be playing Thaddeus Q. Cornflower today. <laughs> I'm, a, uh, I'm a level 19 gentleman. Uh, I'm also a gnome. And I'd like, if I may, to just briefly kind of deconstruct for you all what Thaddeus is all about. Uh, if okay. I could, yeah. if I could. Oh. Um, yeah. I have, a, I have a few very specialized skills that I took. I have the ability to craft comebacks, um, but I'm terrible at it, so... Uh, <laughs> that makes it better. Really, really bad at that. However, I can perform the dance of seduction, and I'm at a masterful level. Very, very good at that. And I've taken the profession gadabout. I'm a gadabout. Mm. <laughs> All right. Also, I speak the languages. Common, gnome, sylvan, and love. <laughs> it's an important one to speak. Yes. And that's, uh, that's pretty much all you need to know about Thaddeus. Mm. Good to know. OK, good. Legendary, legendary gentleman. Wonderful. <laughs> My reputation precedes <clears throat> me. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Megan Caves, and I am playing Jocelyn Nickerworthy. Uh, Jocelyn is uh, level seven, no, 16. She's level 16. Mm -hmm. um, and she's an elf. Uh, she is a gentle lady, of course. Um, and let's see, going through some of these things, she can craft origami, specifically paper uh, flowers. Oh! Mm -hmm. uh, and um, she speaks common elven and politeness, <laughs> very important. Um, yeah, I think and you've that's... named your weapons, right? I have, yes, I have a rapier named Darren and a longbow named, uh, what did I name my longbow? Veronica. <gasps> it was, it was Veronica. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Lovely. Well, this side of the table. Oh, me! Hello! <laughs> I'm Kelsey Osborne, and I will be playing the level 7 gentle nerd. I will be playing <laughs> Luna Brindleberry. Ooh. She's also a gnome, because purple hair, you have to be a gnome. <laughs> um, legally speaking. It's <laughs> legally legal, speaking, is a legal thing. Yeah. you know. Um, my weapons, uh, I've got a set of curved kukri? Mm, yeah. Is that what we decided? Um, yeah. That I wear on my back. And the curved blades make a heart Aww. when put together. And Aww. I also have a ranged weapon, which is a sling that shoots all of the champagne corks and wine corks that I've collected over the years. Because, you know, what is life without a little celebration? It's true. Very true. It's very true. Now, uh, so true. obviously, every, every gentle man, gentle lady, gentle person needs a... Uh, a normal person to really uh, to emphasize how, how, how great they are and how amazing they are. And playing that normal person is our very own Dom Zook. <laughs> Hi, my name's Dom Zook and I'm playing Orex, the F Orc. <laughs> he can't say H. Uh, because it's been established by Tyler Rhodes that all F Orcs speak in a Cockney accent. <laughs> I don't know why, it's canon. but it's true and it's canon and I have an X and its name is Fohammer! Uh, it kind what? of sounded like you said the H in Fohammer there. Uh-oh. Also, Hammer... Because it's the it's, name, it's official. But it's an axe, but it's called Fohammer? What? It's nothing. I don't get it. It's a great name. Not worth it. It's real good. Mm. Yeah, it's not. That's not true, <laughs> really, at this point. So, as every gentleman knows that it, at some point he must pass on his legacy of, of the gentle ways. That's true. So <laughs> you have taken it upon yourself to acquire a mentor, or a men uh, someone you could mentor, and obviously that was uh, Megan's character. Mm -hmm. Now Megan, taking on, you know, so, having been with him for so long, and hit, having him as your mentor, you realize, well, I need to mentor someone, so obviously <laughs> you mentored your character. It's yes. the traditional gentle's person tree of mentorship. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is. It's quite important. Branches and vines wind mm -hmm. all the way down the trunk. All the way down to level one. <laughs> yeah. 
It's all about spreading love. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, along, the, along the way, you met a half orc. <laughs> also, yes. Orax is here. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And also, also Orax. He's here. Yeah. So, you, <clears throat> you've adventured for, for some time now, and you've, you've all uh, grown to know each other, uh, except for Orax. He's a bit of a mystery. Um, you, you've tried your best, but, you know, he's, he's Orax. <sighs> So. Well, we love him anyway. Yes, yes. I, I mean, find him intriguing. Yeah. What? Someday what you you'll intrigue? crack that nut. Yeah. You'll crack it. <laughs> One of these days. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Stop looking at me. You're always looking at me. Why? Because we love you, that's why. It's Don't true. say that word. <laughs> oh, but it's such a, a lovely word. Yes. yes. What? I love the word. Love. love. It's love. Oh, no, you can <laughs> say that one. That one's oh. fine. <laughs> what word what was, was it? What was the been? one? I forgot. Oh. Oh. Mm. So intriguing. He's, he woke up on the right side of the bed today. Doesn't he always? <sighs> I hate you guys. I think he means love. I think so too. Yes. <clears throat> Clearly, yeah. So you wake up from uh, your, your rest, uh, you're staying at a local tavern, and uh, just in, uh, you know, having recovered from, from recent adventures. Uh, so what, what is it uh, that you would do in your morning routine? Well, I'm going to begin the day, as I begin every day, with 30 minutes of bicep curls. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because in order Very to maintain important. my gentlemanly biceps, mm -hmm. that is specifically a requirement of the character, mm -hmm. that I begin the day with 30 minutes of bicep curls. So that's how I start. Mm -hmm. I'll pull my, uh, my eight pound weight <laughs> out of my backpack. He is a gnome that is very high weight for a gnome. Yes, it really? is. Like a me a, weight right yeah, here. <laughs> took me a long time to work my way up to eight pounds. You are yes. per, swole. And that's per arm. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's You're that's a impressive. swole gnome. Yes. Yeah. And I'll, uh, I'll begin the day with a brisk 30 minutes of bicep curls. <laughs> Sounds, it sounds quite good. I, uh, I spend uh, the first 10 minutes brushing my hair, of course, mm. which is very important. So you uh, get that <laughs> lovely thank shine. You, Dun -Jamin. Dun -Jamin. Thank you, Dun 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 Thank you very much for the tip. We appreciate that. And again, uh, if you hit uh, exclamation point tips, you can, uh, you can find all the information on how to, to tip us, and we appreciate it, and that will obviously affect the game. I forgot to explain all of that. <laughs> Not like yeah. it's important. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, your, your tips will actually influence the things that we're doing in this game right now. Uh, so, Except yeah. there's a Herald Cam, potentially, that Ooh, can yeah. happen. And Herald, Herald Cam, look real cute. Herald you, Cam. You haven't Herald looked at our socials. Yeah, yeah, he also dressed up, so. Mm -hmm. There's an yeah. adorable dog in the studio, and if we reach a certain goal, you'll get to see a camera of him. He's wearing a D&D &D bow tie. Who doesn't just... want to look at cute puppies on Valentine's Day? Right? Come on. Yeah. Exactly. I uh, apologize now. I cannot stop winking at the camera. Um, so just assume that that's part of my character and not a weird idiosyncrasy that I am displaying. At least displaying. you can wink. <laughs> well, yes, there's that. Um, yeah, so I, I spend the first 10 minutes brushing my hair, but then I wake up and I'm, I'm ready to go. I don't really have to do all that much to be as wonderful as I am. Yes. So I get to sleep in. I get lots of beauty sleep. That's good to know. You mean you roll out of bed looking like this? Yes, I do. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I don't have to do any work at all. Well done. <laughs> it's the elven way. It is the elven way, yes. Mm. Yes. Well, I like to celebrate each new morning with a glass of bubbly. Oh, yes. Yes. That's very good. Yes. I like that one. Because you have to start off the morning on the right foot. Yes. It's very important. Very important. She's learning well. Yep. She's coming along. Yes, <laughs> quite, right? You're teaching her well, and by oh, proxy, I am teaching you well. <laughs> oh, yes, you always did. Have. Are. Tenses. <laughs> Orax? How do you start your morning, Orax? Well, usually I'm the last one to do watch, so I'm already awake. And then, uh, I don't know why he insists on keeping watch when we're staying at the tavern. And Wait, I don't know. It should be fine. You never know. Uh, people can be quite rude sometimes. Uh, but usually I wake up and I, and I start sharpening faux hammer because I like it to be really sharp uh, at the beginning of the day. And my accent's going to kind of go all over the place. <laughs> That's all right. I might be Australian at one point, <laughs> and then maybe it might go into a Scottish accent. Mm -hmm. um, but I want to say... You're a well-traveled half-orc. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, half-orc. Yes. Half-orc. Oh, yeah. oh. yes. With faux hammer. Mm -hmm. That's important. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. And thanks to the donations in chat, uh, we have unlocked uh, the first tier, which is catchphrases. Oh, so, uh, my. So, Thaddeus, your catchphrase is... Uh -oh. 
Let uh, let me show you my love moves. <laughs> let me show you my love moves. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I remember when I coined that phrase. He says it all the time. Yeah. You Quite. are uh, trained in the, <laughs> the ways of dad. Well, Blue! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome! And thank you for the delightful name. Let yeah. Saving Throw Show know if you'd like to give your reroll out anywhere. Mm -hmm. Or any mod. Alright, so you're sharpening your axe, drinking champagne, doing nothing because you don't have to, and bicep curls. So you. G do we have? All, do we all have catchphrases, or does only Thaddeus? Uh, they're, they're coming. They're coming in. Okay, yeah. got they're it. Coming got in. it. Got it. Appar apparently, mine was uh, was just just fit. They just were fit. just like the dancing, the language of love. They were like, "This is it." Love this moves. Is it, yes. I I want to say one thing, uh, out of character. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, NBs. Anybody who's watching, thank you for joining us. Uh, real quick. Uh, anyone who uh, tips or subs is eligible for our giveaway. Uh, and uh, we have some really cool things uh, to give away. Um, we've got some Old Spice socks. <laughs> oh, look at those. Ooh. How do they smell? <laughs> Wondrous. <Yeah>. Um, <laughs> Uh, uh, body wash. Ooh, that's Captain scented. This is Captain scent. It's the scent of command. Ooh. <laughs> um, and to go along with it, a Captain uh, antiperspirant deodorant. I'm a timber man myself. Mm. Are you a timber man? <laughs> I am. Mm. I'm a fresh. <laughs> Any bear gloves in here? No. Bear gloves? No, no. bear gloves. No. I'm not. No. I'm not wearing the right outfit for no. bear gloves. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, yeah, uh, uh, US, U.S. residents only, I'm afraid. Sorry about that, but uh, um, it, yeah, any subs or, don or tips, uh, make it into the, into the pool, and we'll do that after the stream. So we'll contact you and let you know uh, via Twitch. So thank you very much, so much for yes. tuning in and watching. And yeah, any tips go towards unlocking things that uh, <clears throat> affect the game. So thank you for watching. Uh, back into Orex. What? Well, uh, thankfully, uh, Orex, I believe you have a catch, or is that, how do you spell your name? Orex. <laughs> In the usual way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's fantastic. Orex. A <laughs> U R. Okay. That's what I thought. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Okay, I was just, you also have a catchphrase oh, now. Oh, can I have one of them right implements? He's learning. Yeah, slowly. Ha! <laughs> your catchphrase Next is, time. that's not a hammer. This is a hammer. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Now, Orax, you gain no mechanical bonus from using a catchphrase. It's no. just sort of a fun thing that you can throw in. You know, he doesn't want to feel left out. No, he spent way too much time with us now. <laughs> yeah. Our catchphrases are used to inspire allies. So. Yeah. yeah, I'm a, I'm a barbarian uh, sent by the Elder Council down here, so I don't quite understand you, but you smell good. So I think I'll follow you around. We do all smell. That we happens do. a lot. Amazing. Amazing. Yep. Well, as um, soon yeah. as you hit level seven. <laughs> Luna's... <Yes>. Exactly. <laughs> Luna's catchphrase is now, squee! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Can you actually squee? Squee! Yeah, there you go. That's it. That's probably it. Perfect. Get used to doing that a lot. Yeah. And uh, Jocelyn, you have the, the catchphrase, is that a dagger in your pocket, or are you just happy to see me? Of course I ah. do. <laughs> yes. It sounds very much like Jocelyn. Surprisingly, it's always a dagger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, it often is. <laughs> yeah. Very frequently dagger. Yeah. It's a dangerous world. Yes, uh, but you're just the, the gentle people to conquer it. I'd like to add something to my morning routine. OK. Um, after doing my bicep curls, mm. I would like to glance out the window and make sure that during the evening, the ocean has not encroached. Because if it has, I'm on the lookout for sharks. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have a I have a strong conviction okay. about it's sharks. It's a very big deal. For okay, them. I would I would roll yeah. perception then. Just to... oh, oh, okay. Come on. You need to because it, sure. it doesn't look like it's moved, but you have to like to like it's it's where you remember it, but is it? I have to be sure. Yeah, those sharks the are conniving. The ocean can be quite the deceptive mistress. I rolled a six. Okay. Perception is not among my strongest <laughs> suits. <laughs> this is one of my strongest suits. Ooh, Perception, not mm -hmm. one. You, you notice it seems to be a little closer, but as you stare at it, you, you feel like it maybe noticed and then backed off just an, in, like, just an inch away. <laughs> so I, you, I make note of this. Yeah. <laughs> it's good that you're watching. 
<clears throat> the ocean it's, getting it's bolder. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. He's always He's just watching the ocean. Yes. He did actually write that down, so. But not quite as bold as the sensible stuff. <laughs> Do you have your BA in marketing yet? Yeah. <laughs> very much. You do. I you do I, have your. I don't think I took that. You have your BA in marketing. Oh, okay, yeah. good. That's a gentleman ability. Thank yeah. you. No. That would make sense. You don't have why your. I'm so good at. You don't have your MBA. I just got. <laughs> I just got mine. I have my BA. Mm. Mm. Yes. I'm eagerly looking forward to your presentation. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So you guys. Uh, you're up and about, uh, maybe getting some breakfast in uh, at the tavern, and uh, you see one of the local servers walks up to you and goes, Oh, um... Is that a dagger in your pocket, or are you just happy to see me? Uh, it's, it is a dagger. Oh, of course. <laughs> it usually is, of course. Uh, uh, what can I get you this morning? Oh, um, well, what's the special for today? Uh, bread and... Cheese. Oh, <gasps> bread and cheese. That sounds delightful. Lovely. I'll have a cappuccino and eggs benedict. Thank oh, you very much. Yes. Could I get one of those too? But both of those actually, with the bread and cheese. Uh, uh, yeah. We'll, we'll see what I can do. Um, I'll take chocolate covered strawberries and a glass of bubbly. Oh, okay. Uh, well done. Very good. Yes. Just the bread for me, thanks. I'm lactose intolerant. Okay. Yes, you don't want to give him any cheese or, or milk. Up all night. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We pride ourselves in smelling good. Okay. Yeah. Yes, yes. So he, he disappears for like five, ten minutes, and he comes back, and he gets you a cappuccino and eggs uh, <laughs> and, <laughs> and strawberries. Uh, and he gives, uh, he gives you bread, but apparently, thanks to my rolls, it's cheesy bread. <laughs> no! You were the only one that we so failed. So we all got our impossible up. requests. Yeah. I love it. He got the so one thing. He's, he's, very, he's like covered in sweat and he's like, uh, uh, all right, uh, that was uh, challenging. Uh, uh. You didn't have to eat the whole thing, you know. Well, it's very rude not to eat what's put in front of you. Well, he has learned that. That's least. true. Yes. Very cool of you, Very Arax. polite. Yes. Uh, 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 Oh. Let me know when you guys are ready to go. I'll be upstairs. Safe distance, Orax. Safe distance. <laughs> yes. Uh, it's, I expect you heading towards the uh, Honey Hall Keep after this. Oh, well, should we be going there? Yeah. I mean, it's... it's a, you, you didn't hear here? Oh. No, no. We were all asleep last night yes. during the evening. Oh. Juicy gossip. Oh, yeah. yeah. Every year they do the Crimson Day celebration where they <gasps> celebrate love and, and oh. affection and all that. Um, and there was uh, this year was very special because the crowned prince was was going to be be wed, and it was like a big celebration. Oh, I love weddings. Oh, oh yes. yes. Uh, well, somebody started uh, during the festivities. Uh, someone started firing arrows at everyone. <gasps> My uh, goodness. But uh, it wasn't Cupid, was it? It well. It I mean, it would be acceptable if it was. Yes, yes. exactly. Well, exactly. Non-lethal love arrows are allowed. They, yes, were, yes. they were, but the thing, they were all over the place. Uh, just arrows <gasps> everywhere, and people falling in love with all kinds of different people. The crown prince fell in love with some common orc. That sounds I don't lovely! Know. It's, oh. it, well, the king is, is rather upset by it because uh, oh, that makes sense. The, the wedding was very political, and uh, uh, I see. a lot of tensions in the region. Oh, we so, can't let that stand. No, we? clearly we need to go speak with the king yes. and tell him that love knows no political boundary. Yes, yes. yes. clearly. Uh, I was overhearing from upstairs. I'm back now. Uh, but wait, but it's not love if they were forced into it by getting shot by love arrows. Or X. It's not for us to decide who loves whom or, or why. It's for whoever has love arrows and can shoot them at people. Yes. Cupid knows best. I assume there was a cherubic person yeah, with a bow and arrow? Lying. No, it was just it just a person in a hood using the bow. Sacrilege! Oh, well, that that is not all right. Well, how'd he get love arrows? I, I don't know. You have a boxing glove arrow? I, I don't know. I just live... I, I, it was just as a rumor, as I assumed. I don't know why. I assumed you all knew about this. No, as yeah. I said, we were asleep. Yes. We must have missed the bulk of this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well... 
then perhaps we should stave off speaking with the king until we can make sure that everyone is involved in a consensual relationship with yes. one another. Yes. Mm -hmm. So we should investigate this. Quite, yes. It's our gentle, personally duty. Yes, and, and yours as well. And also Orax, yes. And also Orax. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> All right, Orax, grab your things. Very good. I keep forgetting. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's just, just the, the one, one thing. Pretty much it. Just, yeah. just, right. Shall I have the bags brought down? Oh, yes, that would be lovely. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. $29 and two cents. <laughs> we appreciate Thank you. it. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. uh, so, so your things are gathered, uh, placed on, I assume you have some sort of very fancy cart, like like some, oh. some wagon or something. Mm -hmm. And we tip the bellboy as well. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. It looks like the Cinderella carriage. It does, and it's yes. pulled by a polar bear. Yeah, mm -hmm. of course it is. Of course it is. You know, it's really hot for that polar bear. I don't know if you guys... Ah. <laughs> Ajax? No, he's fine. Yes, he's wonderful. He's a warm weather polar bear. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh. <laughs> just groans. He just groans. <laughs> Ajax, you love the beach, don't you? <laughs> yes, he does. He's got sunglasses on. Yeah. See, he's cool with it. Yeah. Specifically because he's a polar bear. Yes. That's why he's cool with that it. That and the sunglasses. <laughs> it's a two-level oh. thing that yes. we did. Isn't yeah. that wonderful? Now you understand because we've explained it. You learned from that. Well, I yes, did. I, my mind is slightly blown right now. Oh, yes, yes, well. That happens a lot. <laughs> well, perhaps we can get to the bottom of whatever has gone horribly awry at this festival of love, and then, if there's time, I can show them my love moves. Oh, <laughs> yes, very important. I really hope they have bubbly left. Oh, yes, that is very important. We will check for because that. After first. we sort all of this out, we should celebrate. Yes! Fantastic. Perhaps we should celebrate the beginning <gasps> of, of a new yes. endeavor. Let's I celebrate a new journey. Let's do it. Shall I pop the bubbly? Oh, of course. Yes, of course. There's no time to lose. No time at all. Oh. Bubbly. Squeak. Um. She does love her bubbly. Tyler, could we borrow your bottle opener? Oh, yes. Hey! hey. <laughs> oh, thank, you, thank, you thank, thank you for the sub. Yes, thank you for the sub. <laughs> what a coincidental event. Oh. <laughs> Thank Would you very much, visible? good sir. Yes, yes, very Now, important. it is... Always it, have a Tyler. Good it, sir, would you be so kind as to open this bubbly, as you are very higher level than I am? Of yes, course. Yes, yes, It's, I mean... What could go wrong? <laughs> I mean, maybe do it away from the expensive table. <laughs> it's fine. It's, everything's fine. Bubbly is Wait. scary to open. Hold on. It is. Especially <laughs> when it's... it's a pop top. It's got a bottle cap on it. <laughs> there we go. Beep. First try. Which means yes. Thank extra you very much. fancy. It is extra, extra, extra fancy. Cork is not as fancy as this. Okay. Uh, would you care to smell the bottle cap? Oh, yes. <laughs> oh wonderful. Would you like to smell it as well? Yes. Everyone, pass that around. I will keep this in my satchel for shooting at someone later. Oh, yes. All right, I'll make, I'll take pains not to get any of this on the very expensive table. Of course. <laughs> Please continue while I pour the bubbly for everyone. It's important. Yes, it's very important. I imagine that that, that your guys' carriage has a very expensive table in it. <laughs> yes. 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 Well, it does. Where else would we conduct business Everything on the go? Their exactly. carriage is very expensive. You have to go. I'm not going to be able to get this back to you. <laughs> not the same way. <laughs> not like that. Not the same way. We might have to get we'll a. Have to pass it around. Yeah, the get a little yeah, we'll conveyor little... belt going. Mm -hmm. We'll just pass it slowly. Yeah. <laughs> this is our, this is our, the, the standard saving throw champagne break. Um, <laughs> we'll be doing this six to seven times during the game. Very important. <laughs> Thank you very much. Cool. Please don't, don't pause on my, on my account. <laughs> no, we must stay I'm here. perfectly <laughs> capable of pouring bubbly and adventuring at the same time. It's one of my many skills. You are very right. high level. <laughs> thank you, thank you for Just noticing. Just in case any kids are watching, it's actually sparkling cider. Correct. Yes. Yes, Because it's, it's also very early. It's very, it's very early. early. <laughs> and I don't Incredible. drink. Yeah, except for Luna's. Luna's is actually champagne. Yeah. I don't cut corners. <laughs> <laughs> Tastes like apples. All right. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Ambrosia Cheers. apples. Uh, to new beginnings. To new beginnings. New. new be Beginnings. Yes. 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 And hammers. Uh, and and, and hammers, also yes. hammers. He always cool. does find a way to sneak that in there at the last <laughs> minute. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, and uh, apparently tier two has been locked. Oh boy! So, Ooh. so you're all getting punchlines. Oh, oh fantastic! Yeah, that's Which is a great mechanic where it's essentially uh, they say their punchline and it does damage to <laughs> the their opponent. Uh, mm -hmm. Those are all incoming and throws them off their game. It yes. does. <laughs> Which as, as any good punchline would do. Mm -hmm. So you guys, uh, you get in your very fancy carriage. Uh, where are you headed first? Well, it's, as we said, it might be jumping the gun to go and speak with the king. So yes. perhaps we should head to the scene of the love accident mm -hmm. and yes. um, see what we can glean mm -hmm. from looking about. Yes, so, I agree. So you head to the, the scene of the crime, as it were. Um, and it's, I mean. Although love is never. Crime. But in no. this case, it might be, but it Luna. Might be. It There's might be. There's not consent involved. So. Yes. It's very important. So you head there, and it's it's a very open square. It's a, there's a lot of decorations, but you see several uh, several uh, men and women uh, just taking them down and sweeping up all the ticker tape and mm. just like you know like uh, but looking very dejected, uh, maybe more so than you would think that a person in the janitorial arts would be. My gosh, but they have. They, they're gainfully employed, and they're, de they're cleaning up the aftermath of a festival of love. Hold on, this won't do. I'd like to throw open the door to the carriage and yeah. uh, stand at my full three foot one. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd like to make a proclamation Go for it. to the assembled janitorial staff. Mm -hmm. Janitorial service workers, hear me. I, Thaddeus Q. Cornflower, and my amazing, astounding associates are here to save this festival of love. So I ask that you wait. As you go about tidying it up, keep those decorations flying. Today, the festival of love shall continue, but this time, the right way. They, you, you notice like someone stands up and just goes. <laughs> then they all start climbing. There aren't a lot of people around, but they are very, they're very. I graciously they're accept so their good. scattered applause. Yeah. They're just so good. You see them start like like putting decorations back up and straightening <gasps> them all, all together. Oh, yes. we're off to a wonderful start. Yes. yes. We can't let the people of this good hamlet lose faith no. in I'm love. Going, I'm going to take a moment to celebrate that we've arrived at our destination. <laughs> well done. Yes, and let's then, all. Uh, Everyone seems receptive to our presence. Oh, yes. I'll yes, toast indeed. to that. Indeed. Yeah. Indeed. Receptive presence. <laughs> Hmm. I thought he was going to throw an and axes in there, but <laughs> hammers. <laughs> oh, hammers, right. Find the one, really. Hammers that are axes. Hmm. Yeah. So you, you give this rousing speech, and everyone's very invigorated with the idea of love and this festival, the Crimson Day. And uh, you see, you notice uh, one, a man walks up and says, Hello, uh, I, I'm sorry, I don't, I don't believe we've met before. Um, my, my name is, uh, is Henry, and I am... I'm sort of uh, yeah, the the planner of all of this. I can I just say I I A wedding planner. Oh. oh, I mean I have my moments. Mm. <laughs> oh, it is a pleasure to meet you, Henry. Oh, yes. I am yes, Thaddeus Q. Even. Cornflower. Jocelyn Nickerworthy. Oh. Luna Brimbleberry. Mm. Orex. Yeah, this is this er is Orex. Yes. Oh. Not to be confused with Ajax, our super cool warm weather polar oh. bear that pulls <laughs> our carriage. <laughs> Quite Similar, different. Similar, but not. At all the same. No. no. I, I put my hand on his shoulder and I say, Don't worry, love is here and we'll, love can't stop. Very, Very well said. Well, well put. Yes. Nice. Well put. Yes. That was from the heart. You yes, could tell. Yes. I could tell. Look um, at that face. I'm crying a little. Oh, oh yes. Oh. Ooh, uh, yes. Um, okay. That's squeezing just a little yes. bit. Yes. <laughs> uh, will your servant please? Stop hurting me. Why did everyone think <laughs> I'm like a servant? Um, I should take offense, but I won't. Well, yeah. We keep right. telling you it's all about the way you dress for the job you want, Orax, not the job you have. Yes. Um, the Elder Council gave me this. This loincloth. But don't is you want to be sacred. on the Elder Council someday? Mm -hmm. Yes. I am on the Elder Council. <laughs> Oh, well, congratulations! Oh, yeah, good to be there! You did it! Let's toast! Oh, okay. oh. I love it. I love, have to get more I love a good toast. Lorax, no, no, being on the Elder Council mm -hmm. after all this time. No. And wearing the clothes that are appropriate, apparently, for said Elder Council. Yes. I had no idea. <laughs> Neither did I. You never asked. <laughs> he does have a point. <laughs> so, um, yes, uh, I, I, I was the one planning the festival, and uh, it's my first year, and it didn't go according to plan. Ah. Um, so I, I just want to thank you for uh, getting everyone 
maybe back on board. If you could spread that a little bit, that would save my job. <laughs> oh, Absolutely. Yes, well, what is it that went wrong? Well, uh, I, you know, we were doing the festival. Mm -hmm. It was the great... The prince was was parading across the city as he as he was meant to do and celebrate that soon he would be wed and and I our nation. I can see it. You paint with words. Oh, uh, yes. Our nation would no longer be at war and everything would be. There was red everywhere. And then, and then suddenly, uh, an arrow struck him right in the shoulder, and everyone stopped and gasped, <gasps> as if, oh no, an attack. It, it was all a ruse. But then. He didn't cry out in pain. He just, he, he looked at it and then looked down at, it, at another person. And then he just went to that person and grabbed their face and, and held them. And then that person got hit with an arrow. And then the arrows just came raining down, uh, striking all, all over the place. I, I took cover. I, I wasn't sure what was going on. And the people just started loving each other. But... People who had been wed, like old w women marrying uh, young men, and and people leaving their husbands and wives for new people, and it was it was total chaos. Oh my goodness! These arrows fly in the face of romance. <laughs> yes, they, they do. do indeed. This is this is no true love to be celebrated on Crimson Day or no. the day after Crimson Day. So we'll call yesterday Crimson Day, even today Crimson Day. Yes, like of course, that's how it works. Yeah. I'll drink to that. Oh yes, oh, right, we'll... yeah, sorry. Oh, okay. Caught me off guard. Yeah. <laughs> to Crimson Day and Crimson Day Crimson Eve. Day. Yes, I need more. Oh, all right. <laughs> a bit of a lush, but that's fine. Yes, well. Lady Jocelyn, you seem to go through your bubbly quick, quickly. Yes, well, the last part of my name is uh, the inebriated, so. <laughs> It just didn't care. Uh, and thanks to chat, just we've not alcoholic. We've unlocked tier two, which means oh. that you all get punchlines. Punchlines. Yes. Uh, so thank you, chat. So, it is. Uh, Dom, your punchline oh, is: you can't <laughs> spell slaughter without laughter. <laughs> and it's again, true though. No mechanical benefit to yeah. Orax's punchline. Yeah. Uh, Luna mm. is: um, don't you hate it when someone answers their own question? I do. <laughs> Oh, that's good. Uh, for Thaddeus, yours is, there are no men like me, only me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I can get behind it. <laughs> okay. Uh, and sort of apropos, uh, Jocelyn's is, I'm pretty sober, but I'm prettier drunk. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, my. Okay. I see we have a lot of very... Gentle people in chat as well today. Mm -hmm. Yes, well done. Mm -hmm. Appreciate that. All right. Yes, it was. It was insanity. <laughs> just love, free love everywhere, and just no bounds, and 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 people dropping everything. They they women leaving their children behind, men leaving their children behind. Well, so what does this place look like? Is, is there like a balcony? Is there? There's like it, it's it's sort of like a a cobblestone square. Uh, that's uh, very open. There are uh, several uh, buildings along the side, but it's very open. There's a center, uh, like a uh, marble statue and, and fountain in the center that depicting the, the king. Okay. How's he look? Uh, he looks regal. I mean, he's mm. very he's very tall. He has a beard. Mm. Uh, yes, that's yeah. good for kings. Mm. Yeah, he's, he actually has an eye patch, but it's very dashing. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Adds an oh, aura geez. of mystery. Yeah, yes, like, exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah. How did he lose it? Yeah. Well, Jocelyn. Yes. As my mentee. Yes, of course, mentor. What do you think we should do in this situation? Well, I think that we should start questioning the guests, or, or I, I suppose the janitorial staff that is here. They were here during all of this that Everyone happened, right? Was. It's Crimson Day. Yes, of course. So no, Crimson Day start. Eve. Yeah, Crimson Day. Today is Crimson right. Day. Today yes. is Crimson Day. So we should start with questioning, and then maybe we should uh, look around the area and see if we can find anything that seems odd that stands out that maybe would lead us to have whoever this this person or group of people are that caused this horrible thing. And Luna, as my grand mentee. Yes. <laughs> Is there any anything else that that strikes you that we should uh, we should take care of here? I think we should try to find one of these rogue arrows. I like that. Yes. I like that a lot. Yes, it's very smart. So yeah, I picked a good one. Yeah, well done. And Aurax, huh? how are you? <laughs> okay, I guess. Good, oh, good, good, good. Let us know if anything changes in that regard. Yes. 
Or Orox <laughs> might have an idea. Oh, oh, yes. I hadn't thought about it. Uh, of course. Yes, yes. Well, right. Orax. You asking me? Uh, yeah, well, uh, if I was an archer firing love arrows, mm -hmm. where would I be? I think to myself, and I think I would be up on. <sighs> pair up. It's okay, take, take your time. Sound it out. Sound it out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Parapets. Parapets. Oh, yes. that's yes. very yes. smart. Archers are often very self-reflective. Well <laughs> done, Orax. I think you're rubbing off on him. Perhaps, I think we all are. Oh, yes, of course. No, you really are, because my arms smell really good. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, then we definitely are. Yes, we yeah. are, mm. literally. In the carriage ride, it's kind of tight now because of the table. True, yes. All right, well, what say we fan out? All right. I will uh, ask some questions of some of these gentlefolk. As you know, I have a way with people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Orax, mm -hmm. perhaps you should. Thank you. Mortem, Mortem, and Thank you for the Did I just summon a demon? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh no! Oh, uh, we didn't need you. Orax, perhaps you should search I'm for fanning a. Fanning out, like you said. Oh, boss. um, I believe he means disperse, um, Orax. Yes. It is, however. Uh, All right, everyone out! <laughs> oh, 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 wait, not no, no, not, not that. Not, not, not everyone, just. Just, just us. We'll, you go that way. We'll We're go going to split us. Yes. yes. You look for the parapet. Yes, the suspicious right. parapet. <laughs> I wonder if there's pogos here. Might be. There might be. There's only one way to Look find out. That, yes. <laughs> Luna, perhaps you could try and track down one of these rogue arrows. And Jocelyn. Yes. I think there might be more that we can get out of Mr. Henry here. Perhaps oh. you should spend a little time with him. All right, I like where your mind is at, yes. So. Your mind. Never mind. Uh, I'm should we. Away. Oh! Thank you, Jay Rock. Thank you. Thank you for the um, hundred bits. Should we a toast before we go about splitting? Of course. Yes. 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 Very important. Uh, to finding all of uh, the evidence, solving this very quickly. To finding As evidence, evidence and solving, solving it quickly. quickly. Finding, As we always do. Finding quickly. And to hammers, why not? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. To hammers. To hammers. To hammers. Yes. Mm. Even so, hammers. You have to mm -hmm. say the H in hammer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Except <laughs> when you're explaining the rule. <laughs> mm. Well, of course. Right. Elder Council taught me that. Mm. They sound very smart. Yes, they do. Thank you, Jay Rock. Thank you, Jay Rock. <laughs> Deja vu. Yes. All right, so uh, we'll start with Jocelyn interviewing Henry. So, how is it that you got this prestigious job? Oh, thank you, Double GXG. Rob. Double GXG, thank you. How is it that you got this prestigious job? Well, it, I mean, as as maybe you know, the 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 party planning industry is a bit cutthroat. Um, oh yes, quite. Yes, I I've had to do a lot of things uh, that I'm not proud of. Um, oh, you know, like what? Uh, I had to throw a rave. <gasps> a rave. Yes, it's all that. Loud thumping music and the mm -hmm. and the lights and the Technicolor. I just, it's not what I want. It's not. It's I wanted the prestige, of you course. know. Mm. But you threw that rave and then you got this wonderful prestige. Yes, I threw it for a councilman who who recommended me, and that was enough to to get me a, this shot. But I feel like I've I've completely blown it. Thank you. Thank, you. thank you very much for the evening things out. Yes. yes, thank you for that. Well, what councilman was it? Oh, it was a. Uh, 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 it, it was uh, Councilman Hotas. Hotas? Yes, Hotas Far Manor. Oh, Far Manor. Of yeah, course. He's, he's actually, he's, he's quite the officiant. He's actually officiating the, the wedding uh, mm. of the Crown Prince. Oh, and was he uh, hit by an arrow? You know, he, he didn't show up to the event. <gasps> he didn't show up? Well, no. That seems quite suspicious. No, he, his seat was Unoccupied at the time, I don't know where he went. Huh. Well, that's probably something we should check into, of course. Hmm. Well, was there anything else strange? I, I, I assume that you had security for this event. I mean, yes, there were the guards and everything. I thought they had swept everything, uh, you know, it seemed as though, but I, I, I honestly, I don't know where the arrows were coming from. They just rained from the sky, it, it seemed. Rained from the sky. So, mm. so do you have any enemies, anyone who might want to sabotage? I mean, clearly, if this is a cutthroat industry, then there must be someone. I mean, like, certainly there, there are people out there who would, 
try and harm me in some way, but they would just murder me or a member of my family. They would never mess with the prestige of Crimson Day. Uh, this is unheard of. Yes, this is a very low blow, yes. I would say, yes. I expect, I expect this, you know, uh, kidnapping beforehand or something, but never, never anything to, to disturb that. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so you don't think that it could be someone who's trying to get back at you. Maybe there was someone else who wanted this job that no. you got. I mean, plenty of people did, uh, but as I said, they, they would keep it to something civil, like, like murder or right. espionage. And none of that has happened yet? No, okay. no. Hmm. Interesting. Well, do you know, I, I don't know if you would know this one, but uh, did the prince have any enemies, or, or maybe even the king? The king I mean, clearly. The king has enemies. The, 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 uh, I mean, the elven nation to the north, the, the, the prince is marrying their princess so to stop all the hostilities. We've been mm -hmm. sort of in, in, a, in a state of perpetual preparedness for war, and this is meant to ease that tension. Yes. So maybe, perhaps, people on that side didn't want this to go through because they wanted war. I don't know. I just plan parties. Hmm. All right, well, I think you've given me all that you can right now, but uh, stick around. Maybe we'll have more questions for you later. Uh, thank you. Oh, yes, thank you. All, all right. right. <laughs> so, what were you... I want to I wanna fan out myself. Yes. And uh, speak to the uh, assembled general public. Yeah. <clears throat> And I'd like to ask them, uh... Oh, thank you, Alex. General public, <laughs> could you point out anything irregular or strange that you noticed about the, the ceremony, festival yesterday, which is now today? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, uh... Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I, I forgot to ask nicely. Oh. Uh, Please. Oh, uh, thank you. Uh, <laughs> he winked at me. Uh, I yeah, I can't <laughs> seem to stop doing that. It was, uh, you know, it, it was like a normal party, you know, uh, Crimson Day, uh, but... Crimson Day Eve now. Yeah, oh, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, then I saw a man in a, in a hood. Mm. Uh, I thought maybe he was a guardsman or something, uh, part of some, I, I don't know, some, some military man. He, he looked uh, like he could take care of himself. Uh, he had green skin, he might have been an orc, I don't fully know. Mm. Uh, he had a, a fancy bow. Uh, I didn't quite see it. it like was, a decorative bow? Yes, it was wrapped. It, it was like, I saw it, it was under his coat, it was like holding it, and I saw, but I saw the outline and it peek out a little bit. Uh, forgive me, I fear that we may be on a different page here. Are you mm. speaking about a weaponized bow or a bow that one might affix to a gift? Oh, no, a weapon, a weapon. Ah, of course. If, if we were just carrying some roses, I wouldn't have done twice. I just was like... Well, those would be flowers, not a bow. Okay. I don't You're know. welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Modern Joe. <laughs> thank thank you, Modern, modern Joe. Thank you for the 25 bits. Yeah, I, I, I didn't think anything of it at the time, you know, it was a big, everyone's here and stuff. I ain't seen him before, but you know, it was a big party and then the arrows came and then I thought, maybe this guy, I, I don't know. All right, all right. <laughs> well, thank you very much. I would like to use my catchphrase mm -hmm. to grant this, this fine individual um, a bonus on the next believing in himself check that he has to make today. So, I take him, I put a hand warmly on his shoulder and I, I say, you seem like a nice fellow. Let me show you my love moves <laughs> and perhaps you can use them later on today for your benefit. So I'm gonna add 5d6 to his next <laughs> skill yeah. check. So that's five, 12. 12. 13. I'm gonna give him a plus 13 bonus to his next skill check today. Okay. There's a lot of false love going around here on new Christmas Day. Crimson Day. <laughs> Crimson Day. <laughs> so, uh, why don't you find yourself something real? I mean, I, I, I always a fancy Jenny. Oh, she, she works at the Tanners. Oh, I never had the courage to ask no. her out, but... Go and tell her how you feel, my friend. Uh, you know what? Oh, I will. He drops his broom and like <laughs> just storms off. And as he goes, I wanna, I wanna just sigh wistfully because, though I have been gentlemaning for quite some time now, I've never yet found that one special person for me. But maybe today on Crimson Day, which used to be the day after Crimson Day, maybe today <laughs> is the day. Mm -hmm. 
So, <clears throat> Luna, what is, what is Luna up to? I am searching the grounds for these rogue arrows. Mm -hmm. Or I might not be. <laughs> <laughs> we will see. Wait, my perception is not horribly terrible. 13. Okay. Uh, so, you search around, and it's hard. Uh, you talk to some people, and uh, you hear stories of like the arrows when they strike a person uh, very soon dissipate because mm. they're magical. But you're like looking, and people are like, I don't, I don't think they exist at all anymore. And, but you do happen to find uh, sort of the broken end of of a shaft that it's it's very pastel pink, and it has a uh, very like red uh, fletching on it. Mm. You think this might be one of them. So there's no arrowhead, but just yeah. the... <gasps> I'll take this with me. Can I notice anything else about it? Uh, Does it smell see. like anything? <laughs> I would say you could probably mm. try and... Do you have any, uh, what is it, arcana in the system, or? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I do not. Knowledge arcana is not a skill granted <laughs> yeah. a gentle person. No, yeah. we don't know But I would that. say that, uh, give me, you could do another sort of investigative role okay. about it. Okay. Because you do, you do know love. I do know love. White. Yeah. If there's one thing I do know, <clears throat> yeah. it's love and how to celebrate that love. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so you said in, so just another, what, perception check? Sure. In bed, what, I'm trying to remember what the uh, skills are. I think per perception. Perception yeah, probably okay. makes the most yeah. sense. Most of us rolled Oh. oh that's not, not today. <laughs> not it's okay. I just need more of my love juice, which is lovely. Blind, blind, blind yeah. seer, thank you for the seer. Thank you. Okay. Hello, blind seer. Uh, so thank you for the $16 tip, blind seer. I should seer. probably Ask my mentors about this arrow. Yes. I don't think I'm high enough level to understand the gravity. Mm -hmm. I'll take a look. <laughs> Orax, <laughs> what do you think of this pink arrow shaft that I found? Mm. Looks pink. Yes, that's what I thought as well. Yeah, I think you're. I think you're on the right track. Okay, I'll I'll keep it and yeah. I'll show it. I'll show it to the others. Sure. Yeah. Thank yeah. You, yeah. No, that's, yeah. I appreciate all of the help you give us. You're yeah. a very sweet, gentle soul, and I appreciate you. I will sort of, like, Rick on a little. I'll say, like, you, you have it, and you want to investigate it, but you also feel like you're getting a little bit low on champagne. I, <laughs> I am, though, is the thing. It's not just a feeling. I hope it's that the reality wherever they life. are right now, Luna is making Orax feel <laughs> included and important. Oh, well, she always does, so... And I hope nice. she's uh, re-upping her champagne flute. <laughs> oh, you know she carries uh, plenty of champagne I with do. her. She's so got her chantine. Yes, chantine is <laughs> very important. Ah, oh, I love it. Okay. Orax? Mm -hmm. What is Orax up to? Uh, Orax is looking around for uh, perhaps a trail or some other uh, uh, leavings. Of of a of a hooded figure, mm. mm -hmm. an hooded figure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, there it hooded. is. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I would say uh, yeah. Roll perception, I guess. Yep. <laughs> uh, We're not the best at rolling perception. <laughs> Apparently not. It's a ten. <clears throat> All right. So uh, you you don't see any clear signs because it's cobblestone there's not a lot of footprints and stuff and a lot of people have come through so it's very hard to to if you're looking for a specific person or tracking somebody it's very challenging in this environment uh, but you do notice that there are uh, several high uh, buildings with parapets that could possibly suffice parapets yeah and then uh, uh, through your sort of you kind of narrow it down to two culprits that seem like, based on like where people were saying they were being struck from, like that just, these would be the most <laughs> obvious places that they could have shot from. I just so. imagine Orax beautiful minding this right now. Yes. Well, if we go net, we're in the sun, we yeah. <laughs> and then he fires, where would I be if I was firing a bow? And then he just tracks it up to one, yeah. of, these, yeah. one of these spots. Yeah. Okay. Um, so I'll go, I'll go up there to see if I can, if there's anyone over there or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> see if there's any archer leavings. Yes. <laughs> you never know. Archers with hoods. 
Uds. 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 Archers with Uds. Mm -hmm. There you go. So I'm still learning how to speak your, always, your language. I don't. I appreciate that you're always trying to improve yourself, Orax. Yeah, I, I, I have a, I have a very strong conviction that every day I have to learn something. And if I don't learn something, then I feel I failed that day. So today I'm learning about angles. I'm going to celebrate the fact that today oh. you have accomplished your goal and learned something. Wherever Come we on. are, my thing oh, goes yes. off. Yes, I feel like we should celebrate Perhaps something, uh, something uh, mathematical, oh, I think. Yes, there I we like are. Mm -hmm. To math. It makes me feel tingly. <laughs> that means it's working. <laughs> so you you head up into this building, and it seems like it's not a very well-used one. Thank you for Thank the 50 minutes. Thank you for the Supreme, 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 Supreme. Oh, Supreme. Admin bot. Oh, Supreme yes. Admin bot. I, I saw Mead in there, too. Yeah, Super Mead in bot. Mead him. So you, you find uh, this building uh, doesn't seem to be occupied at the moment. Um, and uh, you notice that uh, when you get the, the lock of like the, the, for the stairwell has cl clearly just been broken in. So somebody broke in. But when you get up there, you don't see any signs of anybody left behind. Uh, anything really all that interesting but it's clear that someone was probably this is probably the location that that the person fired from mm. Mm. no leavings no <laughs> i mean you, you can give me a perception <laughs> roll again yeah yeah try it give it a shot perceive perceive oh. Ooh. Uh, uh that's a 24. It's 24. because we celebrated your success of yes. learning yeah. things you <laughs> You smell your dreaded nemesis cheese. There's cheese crumbs <gasps> all around. That this person Gee, get it off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cheese. This person uh, was eating at least some cheese while they were up here waiting. Mm. You feel it's a, it's a, it's a like a, it's a very strong smell, like a, a like a monster. Mm. Oh, yeah. Disgusting. Yeah. Um, I'll I'll head back, um, just with the most disgusted look on my face. <laughs> hey. All right, I think I found where he was. Oh. Or she, uh -huh. or, or not. We're looking for a potentially a green-skinned individual wearing a hood with a decorative bow for firing arrows, not for ah. tying up fashionable and gifts. And not a tie. Oh, and, oh yes, tie, yes, yes. Oh, well, I didn't ask that follow-up, but oh. no, you're probably right. That it's would not be a tie. Similar okay. to decorative bow. Yeah, I believe yeah. so. Yes, in the well, same family. Allow me to add a bit. Oh. oh, yes. Our villain likes cheese. <gasps> oh. Mm, the cad. So mm. chat would like to know if uh, bits count towards the giveaway. Orax, would you like to field this one? Um, no H's, remember. Uh, <laughs> bits, are <a> little <laughs> bits are a little hard to track. Um, uh, so I will say E no. Sorry. <laughs> no. Sorry, no bits. He really faked us out there for yeah. a moment. <laughs> Sorry, it's, it's like... really hard. I, I, I would have to kind of set a limit with bits and that would be weird and I don't want to... Yep. Yeah. Also, but chat I... just wanted Jordan to know that they love Thaddeus. Oh, thank you very much. Thaddeus is pretty great. Thaddeus, Thaddeus exists in the realm that he is because of the aid and help of his mentee chain. Yeah. <laughs> Very and also Orax. And how to have Orax. that as a, as a gentle person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Anyway, he likes cheese. Hmm. He's a cad. I don't like him. And I want to find out where he is. Do you think he could have been If up? it is a he, I don't know. They. What if exactly. they were up there having a nice romantic breakfast with someone? <gasps> some cheese, some grapes, oh, geez, some nice a fancy breakfast. bread, and things got out of hand and the arrow started flying. Mm. A lover's quarrel. Mm. Oh, it could have been. Oh, mm. It's funny, because quarrel and uh, arrow bolts. It's a, oh, it, yes, no, I see. Yes, <laughs> jokes are funnier when you point them out. I have, you my can't instincts spell have been water without laughter. That's true. <laughs> my instincts Borax. have been the time. A thing that he says. Yes, yes. he does say that a lot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Classic Orax. Yes. 
Well, then, um, are we done here? Should we go to the next spot, or, or should we do a little bit more searching? We should definitely talk to some of these people who have been struck by the arrow. Yes, uh, are, yes. are they here? I don't, I don't, um, Henry? Yes? Um, are any of the poor unfortunates who are locked into loveless, love-laced relationships now, are they roundabouts? No, uh, many of them are in their, their homes or whatever, exploring their new love. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Well, unpleasant. Where is it that the prince Most is? unpleasant. Oh, the prince, he's, he's in the tower right now. The king had him put Chloe, away. Thank you for the stuff. Stuff. Thank you for the In the tower. Perhaps we For his own protection. Yes. Maybe we should speak to the prince, if at all possible. It does seem like perhaps he was the target of this attack, mm. the intended target. Perhaps mm. the rest was meant to <gasps> sow confusion. What about the, the one A who's... distraction of love arrow. I oh, believe yes. so, Luna. Devious. What about Quite. the one he was going to marry? Where is she, or or he? Uh, he... Or it. Oh, yes. I, I know I have a friend who married a gelatinous cube. They're mm. very happy together. Well, uh, yes, he he was in uh, in his kingdom. They, they they would meet on the wedding and in exchange vows, and and it would be a, a lovely ceremony. The two princes marrying, and mm. ending oh. the hostilities. Mm. Two princes. Yeah. Mm. I love that song. <laughs> yes. Could, no. Never mind. No. <laughs> <laughs> However, for legal reasons, I cannot remind any it. of you how it sounds. <laughs> yes, I can't think of the lyrics anymore. Yeah. Or the or melody. Or the tune, yes. or yes. any of it. But I know I like it. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I could maybe think of five seconds, but no more. <laughs> no more than that. Uh, Let's all have a little think about two princes. Yes. And while we do, we can uh, thank mm. chat for unlocking cheer three, which oh. is, uh, which is uh, re-rolls. Oh, thank you very much. I don't know. You... It's three for the table. Oh, three, three, the three table nice. rerolls. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, We're not good at perception, so that so will yeah, really help. Yes. Going to help. They they also very much love Luna and her hair. Oh, uh, thank you. Um, is does Orac still seem bothered by um, the lingering scent of strong cheese? Yes. All right. I would like to use my pleasurable smells to heal him of 1d12 nose stuff, if yeah. I could. <laughs> yes. It seems like he's suffering with some nose stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. he got like he got really into it, like smelling. He's like, there's something here. I don't Ooh. know what it is. Wow. I healed him of 12 nose stuff. Wow. <laughs> Whoa. I just smell my own stink. <gasps> oh, yes. well. you may have cleared his sinuses too well. Yes, I think you went well, too far. But with any luck, he'll have forgotten what cheese even smells like. Oh, oh trees. It worked! <laughs> Fantastic. You, you can't good. recall. I'm going to celebrate that yes. Orax is no longer oh. haunted by that wretched scent of cheese. Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll oh. drink to that. Orax. To a bet. Oh, Orax, no, your glass is empty. Probably. Yes, you need more. On this crimson day, we cannot allow anyone's glass to no, be empty. No, right. Glasses may never run Might empty on crimson day. I like supreme mead. If you have any. <laughs> Fresh out of supreme mead. Oh. But I do have plenty Only of the bubbly stuff. Bubbly. Mm -hmm. Bubbly. Mm -hmm. Bubbly. Mm -hmm. Bubbly. Bubbly. All right. Bubbly. So, shall we to the palace? Sure. Yes. Let's. Uh, Ajax, away! <laughs> <laughs> it's a slow carriage. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I wanted to make a clip clop sound, but Ajax doesn't make a clip clop sound. He doesn't. He, <laughs> he makes sort of like a pad click sound. Yeah. 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 But it's smooth. It is yeah. very, very smooth. I'm really good with Ajax, I think. You probably I'm are. 21 to my handle hand. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he loves you. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes, don't get... He doesn't like it when you approach him from that direction. Yes. yes. You mean straight ahead? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Have to come in from the side. Yeah, his, his sunglasses obscure his vision mm. from the front. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah. has better peripheral, if you can believe right. it. Yes. Mm. He's also got those cool mirrors on the inside <laughs> so we can see behind yeah. him as well. Well, Ooh, he has to pull a carriage. It's important yes. for traffic safety. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> So about like three hours later, maybe yeah. we make it to the, <laughs> to go to the like palace. one mile. <laughs> well, yeah, it's it's not that far, but he does like Ajax does stop every once in a while, and you have to feed him uh, honey mead. Mm. <laughs> Wait, no, that's this is honey mead. You know what Ajax likes? Yes. Jocelyn keeps him on a strict diet. Oh. Yes, it's very important. All right, well, you wouldn't want it. But it's mid level. It's mid level at it's best. It's not super. No. No. Right. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm. All right. Not the supreme stuff. So uh, you eventually make your way to the palace. It's uh, it's a fairly fairly lavish palace. I mean, you've seen 
better, but it's... <laughs> lavisher. Our own, yeah. our own uh, yeah. uh, home is, is a little better than... It's a little yes. quaint compared to what you, you're yes. used to, but mm -hmm. uh, you feel like that that's what they're probably going for. Okay. I think it's adorable. Oh, quite, yes. It does have that yeah. adorable Cute. <laughs> Oh, yes, Thank you, Supreme Maid Bot. Meet and Bot. Thank you for the bits. Thank you. <laughs> so you make it your way. Uh, there, there's several guards, and they look at you very confused about uh, a carriage being pulled by a polar bear. A cool polar bear. Yeah, a very <laughs> cool polar bear, like the kind you'd see in a commercial or something. Uh, and then they're like, uh, hello. Is that a dagger in your pocket, or are you happy to see me? Are you granting anyone a bonus with that catchphrase? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> uh, it's, yeah, yeah, it's, a, it's a dagger. Of course it is. It's, it's, always, a it's, it's, a it's always a sure, dagger. It's always a dagger. Sure, yeah, I'll grant, I'll grant him a, uh, uh, a bonus to, let's see, this is a guard. Yes. Um, to perception, mm. because uh, clearly that is needed. Oh, here, let me use some of your 5d6. We can do this at will. Yeah. <laughs> so that's eight. Uh, uh, 10. 10. That was it. 10. All right. Well, so he gets 10 to his perception. So uh, he, he <laughs> looks at you and rolled perception, and with that, he got a 21 total. And he's like, he's like, oh, you're the, you're the gentle people. Oh, and yes. Aurax. And Aurax. And Aurax, yes. Oh. Don't forget him. And Ajax, too, as well. Oh, yeah. From the bear. Uh, I've, I've, I've heard of you. Oh, hey. Yeah. Now I am happy to see you. Oh, isn't that lovely? Still has a dagger, though. Is it still, yeah. a still a dagger? dagger. Yeah, it's still a dagger. Maybe a dagger. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, do you guys want to go inside? Oh, yes. We'd yes. very much love to. That would be lovely. Love. Uh, yes. uh, please, please, open the door. Yeah, um, after, after you. Trevor, oh, no, no, open no, the no. door. No. I insist. After you. Oh, no, 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 well. please, both of you. After both oh, of you. No, no, we must let you go yes, first. Yes, please, you are after the you. mentor after you. No, no, but you. as you are both my mentees, I must insist that both of you please go oh, after you. Are you. So you know what? Because of that line of thought, after you. I could I... possibly, Orax, after oh, you. Oh, yes, Orax. Orax, yes, after, after you, you Orax, yes. 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 Okay. And Orax goes through. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then now. The rest of us, well, why don't we just go in together? I think it's big enough. So uh, just, just link, side by side, link, yeah, link arms, arms <laughs> and we'll go through. All right. And we yes. have entered the portway. <laughs> Let's celebrate this entrance yes. into this lovely, adorable And BSB Care. <laughs> and oh, oh, yes, BSB Care. Care. Thank you very much, BSB Care. And thank you, the spirit of politeness. Mm. Oh, yes, it's a very good language. Everyone should learn to speak it. I'm, working, I'm a bit rusty. Yeah. <laughs> you should practice that. P's and Q's, I get them switched. Mm, <laughs> so you make your way into the foyer of, mm -hmm. of the palace. It's, it's... I would like to, I would like to create something dumb here. Okay, yes. Uh, once per session, all of us gentle people are allowed to change some trivial detail about the world that remains in place for the rest of the session. Mm -hmm. So the castle is decorated with clown paintings. Ah. Uh, just Absolutely. everywhere. Like, everywhere clown paintings. Like oil, like uh, the, those terrible velvet. velvet. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Black velvet clown paintings. Yeah. 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 Obviously. I mean, that's, that's, the, <laughs> that's probably the most striking thing when you enter, is, yeah. is, is yeah. that. Well, you know, sad clowns usually insinuate some sort of internal trauma, which often is caused by a heartbreak. Mm. So really, these are quite romantic. Yes, they are very romantic. I like your line of thought. I hadn't that. thought yes. about it like that, This Luna. may be the most romantic, sad room I've ever been in. Guys, I just want to say I'm a little creeped out right now. Um, Why, Orax? Are you ashamed to be in the presence of so much love? No, it's just the, the clown eyes that they're following me. They do seem to be following you. Yes, yes, no matter where you go, they do trace yes, you. Yes, they do. That's just them bestowing love upon you, I oh. think. Yes. Oh, well, that's comforting. Um, yes, isn't it? Speaking of bestowing love, Chad has unlocked tier four, which oh. is a pitch meeting. Oh, Whoa. a pitch meeting? <laughs> Uh oh! All right, so well, we yeah, all have to go meet the king, what? right? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna meet the king. So oh, maybe, maybe uh, if you could grab um, a product for each of us out of the box, and we're gonna have to come up each one of us with our best attempt at a at a one sentence slogan for this product, oh, yes. and we can pitch it to the king. Okay. Okay. I like it. Yes. Oh. All right. So so, uh, as guards will escort you to the king fairly easily. You see him standing there looking very 
dejected and, uh, and sad, uh, though still very ruggishly handsome. Mm. He's reminiscent of the paintings in the hall. Yes. Mm. And also the statue of him in the town yeah. square. Yes. A, split, a striking resemblance, yes. actually. Well, who might you be? Oh, well, I am Jocelyn Nickerworthy, and uh, this is my mentor. Thaddeus Q. Cornflower. And my mentee. <laughs> Luna Brimbleberry. And this is uh, Orax. That's Orax. Orax. Yes. Welcome to my home, as it were. Uh, oh, yes, a lovely, adorable home that you have. Love what you've done with the place. Very oh, sweet. Very so sweet. much love here. Uh, in my youth, I uh, courted a woman who, who besmirched my me and, and married another. Oh. So oh. I, I've been heartbreak. beset by heartbreak. Oh. I thought the Crimson Day this year would bring me from, from my, my stupor, but well, sadly. Well, that's why we're here, actually. We, we've come to help. And today is uh, Crimson Day do-over, as it were. Mm, yes, so. yes. But mm -hmm. yeah, one moment, you strike me as a man who could use some captain body wash. <laughs> Command your pits. <laughs> well, you know, along those lines, I actually think if you're using the captain's body wash, you should also be using the captain's deodorant. Um, because if you are going to command someone, you should also smell of command, right? Mm. And along with that, ambassador scent of excellence whenever you are dealing with the elves, right? Yes, very important. So I recommend yeah. both of these. You could do one on one arm and the other on the other. Mm -hmm. Have and, both. And while you're protecting yourself from perspiration, you may want to also protect yourself from having critters run up your pant leg. <gasps> oh, oh my, yes. My Look least favorite thing. Long socks. Oh. And also, he's on a horse. It's important part. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he, uh, or, <laughs> we yes, all look right. expectantly or, or at Orax. <laughs> I, I have a hammer. I'm not good at things. Uh, yes, that very, was a very good try. Very yeah. good try, yes. 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 Very good it's try. Wonderful that you tried. He's our closer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I mean, any uh, product, uh, body wash and, and deodorizing product, is, uh, 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 I will use such things. Uh, my mind is <laughs> elsewhere at the moment, but... Mm. Well, allow us to bring you this royal gift. Yes. Happy... Crimson Day do-over. Yes, yes. yes. As I do not. Uh, uh, my steward will take them. I will. Of course, yes, you. <laughs> <laughs> steward, what are you doing? Steward, your sorry. steward is quite clumsy. Sorry, 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 sorry. It's People a lot to carry. It's a lot to carry. It's a lot to carry, sir. Ah, uh, steward. Yes. He's a, he's a buffoon, but I love him. Yes, yeah. mm. well. Sometimes love is right under our noses. Mm. Yes, it is. Maybe you should show him some love moves so he can be less yes. clumsy. Perhaps later. <laughs> but first we must, uh, we must learn from the king. Yes. What, what is the cause of his current heartbreak? Yes. Mm. Uh, currently, I had hoped that uh, the marriage of my son to the prince of, of the principality across the sea would end the hostilities between our two families. Mm. Uh, it has been my life's work to end the wars that have plagued my line for so long. And, uh, here we are, my prince in love with another, uh, due to some sort of, uh, some tomfoolery with, with arrows on our mm. on a most, most sacred day, which we uh, now have to move to today instead of tomorrow, yes, apparently. Yes, of course. Yes. 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 It's a do-over. Yes. Well, you know, I applaud you trying to heal your country's wound because nothing heals quite like love. And you know what? Mm. I will drink that. As will yes, I. Yes, yes, that's oh. very good. Uh, right, mm. Stuart! Uh. <laughs> it's like, here you go, sir. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't spill that one, that was good. Oh, very good. Yes, you're getting better. Oh, thank you, yeah. thank you. Mm. Uh, that is enough, Stuart. <laughs> <laughs> I see a bright future for you, Stuart. Mm. Now... <laughs> right, his name's... Stewart, right? Yes, Stuart. I assumed that's what Stuart the king had been the saying. Stewart is what I heard. He is. Mm -hmm. hmm. His name is Stuart. Uh, he is my steward. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Convenient. <laughs> makes sense. Yeah. No, yeah. no matter what it sounds like you're addressing him, so. Even when you're drunk on bubbly, <laughs> yes. you can still, uh, you can still. 
contact him and he'll know exactly who you're He was obviously born for the job, so. Very clearly. Only stewards can be stewards. Mm. Mm. Yes, in this Mm -hmm. kingdom. Mm. Mm -hmm. Even in the Elder Council, we know that. Now, tell me. Your Ooh, thank you, Supreme <laughs> okay. Main Bot. Supreme thank you. Main Bot. <gasps> now, before the incident today, outside, the uh, prince that he is betrothed to, were they in love? I mean, in, in as much as any arranged marriage could be. Mm, I see. They both seem... So a lot. Yes. yes. <laughs> yes. They, they both seemed fine with the endeavor. Had they exchanged letters? Yes. Pen pals, love letters. Yes, they had. Spritzed with a little bit of fragrance. Mm. Oh yes, I believe he sent he sent him a fine elven horse. <gasps> oh, it was, it was most kind. Uh. Wait, the horse was an elf, no. much like a normal horse, just with uh. pointier ears. I believe. Back me up on this, yeah. Jocelyn. Oh, yes, 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 it's it's quite expensive pointier. to pull him off a horse. <laughs> <laughs> Give it the features of an elf. <laughs> <laughs> well, yes. clearly they've spared no expense. No, no, well they wouldn't. It's a, it's a, that's what I was saying. It's a great sign of love. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Your I, Majesty, might I just say, uh, I love your voice. Uh, thank you very much. You have a very regal carriage about you, and uh, just so do look forward mm. to you continuing to speak. It's got a certain grit to it. It's very voice. alluring. It's what I've done all my life. It certainly doesn't hurt my throat. <laughs> Did you spend any time in uh, with the Elder Council up north? No, I don't believe I did. Mm. Well, funny. I, I did smoke for many years. I had to give it up. That's Terrible what it is. Habit. That's Terrible what it is. You should yeah. always quit. It's never too late to quit. Oh, no, no. no. Now, who, is, who has he become infatuated with now? Some common uh, orc I'd not heard of before. He's a stable master. Mm. Hmm. Uh, is the happy couple uh, here presently? Uh, in a manner, uh, uh, the prince was placed in the tower for his own protection, and uh, his orc lover of some kind, they, he is uh, he's standing at the gate, pounding away, demanding his love be returned to him. Oh, the loud fellow we drove yes. past. Oh, yes. yes, we did see him. We should go speak with him at some point. I think we should speak mm-hmm. with both of them. Mm-hmm. Yes. What say you, Orax? Orax? DJ Thank you, Regular. DJ Regular. Oh, no, well, that's all well and good, but yes. a bit beside the point right now, Orax. <laughs> but aside from DJ Regular. Who we very much thank. Well, yeah, we should talk to whoever, right? Yes. I think. Oh, yes. Yes. yes, yes, very smart, yes. I'm going to back that play. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. Well, perhaps uh, the prince first, and we can speak to his uh, orcish paramour on the way out. Yes, yeah, sounds wonderful. Uh, which way to the prince? Oh, it's, uh, if you head down uh, out, out the keep, uh, look for the giant tower. <laughs> oh, oh, perfect, okay. yes. And Thank just you. right inside. Yes. Right. The top, or...? And the prince is in the top. Okay. Okay. Yes. okay. Is it perhaps like a... Like a, I don't know, like a craft table or something midway, mm. in case we mm-hmm. need refreshment. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I could have Stuart follow you along. Oh, oh, that would be good. If it's not too much trouble. That was oh, lovely, no. actually. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, anything, I guess that's fine. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, well. You've lost your, your, your microphone. Oh, I lost my voice, got it back. There you go, perfect. Your booming gnome voice. That's right. <laughs> my gnome voice. <laughs> Tiny little gnome voice. Barrel yep. chested. Yeah. So. Yes. Yeah. It's well, all it's those uh, curls. curls. <laughs> it's yeah. all those curls. I must say, you, for a gnome, you're in uh, a smashing shape. Oh, thank you very much. I, uh, I mean, it's not. Uh, and then I just I rip one of my tearaway uh, suit <laughs> sleeves to to bear my my bicep and my just fle- Ooh, <laughs> flex quite, it. Quite impressive. A bit, which gives me a plus five to all of my charisma checks. Nice. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, you know, I can't, you know, keep the sleeves off all day. Now, I do have a uniform to maintain, mm-hmm. yes. but uh, you may gaze. <laughs> oh, I do. It's <laughs> all right. hard to look away, I know. Happy Crimson Day mm-hmm. do over to you, Your Majesty. Mm-hmm. I like him. Oh, yes, it's wonderful. It seems uh, nice. Mark, yeah. mm-hmm. That voice. Something about it. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, perhaps, <laughs> perhaps we'll be back later. Maybe we should... To the tower? Yes. To if we the must. Tower. Yeah. So you well, make your way... Well, after you. <laughs> oh, oh, no, I couldn't. After you. Oh, yeah, well, both of you should go first, of oh, course. But, but, but you're our mentor, so you, you should go. Well, maybe Stuart. Oh, yes, 
Stuart, 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 Stuart after, after you. Oh, after I, 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 I couldn't. I'm, uh, I'm supposed to stay behind you at all times. I'm oh. like just. T I, oh well. Oh no. That that will not do. Oh, Today no. after you. Oh yes, it is Crimson Day. Crimson Day. After all. Mm -hmm. uh, you mean it? Oh yes. Of course. Oh, oh, Thank you Dungeon. for the tip. Thank you. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. And he sort of like goes out and he goes and then he stops for a second. Oh, I should probably get my stuff first. <laughs> oh, yes. oh right. Yes, yeah, yes. That's, that's important. Yes, we'll wait. Yeah. So he gathers a, a a pack of belongings and then heads out. All right. Now, and yes, the rest of you? After you. Oh, no, no, I insist. No, no. Please. Ah, oh, thank you. Duke Novalift. Oh. Duke Novalift. Thank, thank, thank you for, for the, the sub. Thank, thank you. We'll be heading to your dukedom next. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, oh, I couldn't. I couldn't. Uh, um, uh, Aurax, if you are uh, after you. Right, OK. <laughs> uh, yeah. Shall we? OK, yes. All together. All together. <laughs> And step through the door. Clap, <laughs> clap, clap! Hey. 200 biddies. We appreciate that. So you guys head out the door and you make your way towards uh, the tower. It's not very far from, uh, it's within walking distance of the keep. Okay. And then as you get there, there's, uh, it's, it's clearly, it's locked up and there are guards on the other side of, of the door probably, but you see this orc, it's like, open up please. Please let, let my love go. Oh, oh my. Um, I feel bad for the orc. I do. I do too. It's just something you don't want to see. No. No, no, it isn't. Unrequited love, even if it's magically induced, is mm. the saddest of all magically induced loves. Yeah. The heart hurts. Yes. And uh, thanks to that last tip, <clears throat> tier five has been unlocked. Wow! Oh, wow. Trying real hard. <laughs> oh, trying real hard. Okay. Well, that's just because Orax has to pal around with a bunch of gentles peoples, and he he's not. You know, quite at the same level as everyone else, but he wants to try. I'm a level six. <laughs> yeah. And he's doing a fantastic job. So good job. at being level yes. six. Level six elder council. Really yes. good. Yes. Yes. But because he's at somewhat of a disadvantage, being so near the rest of us, <laughs> for the rest of the session, Orax gets to roll with advantage, <gasps> meaning he gets what? to roll two d twenty wow. and keep the highest result for the rest of his rolls, just to kind of help him give give him a little nudge to put him on par with the gentle peoples. Wow. This call for a oh. celebration. Yes, I couldn't yes, agree more. Yes. Mm -hmm. To Orax, trying just so hard. Trying so, so, hard. so hard. Orax hard. To, to, to yeah. Orax. No, we're probably going to have to... Uh, <laughs> it's not, sometimes uh, when you shorten the toast, it works really well, but that was one that changed the intent quite a lot, Orax. Yes, it did, yeah. mm. Quite a lot. Okay. Keep just trying. Watching. Yep. Try, Especially try on Crimson again. Day, you're going to want to watch uh, shortening oh, it to that. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. mm. Well, should we speak with this poor orc? Yes, yes absolutely. Um, oh, uh, uh, I'm sorry, uh, hello, I don't know your name. Oh, uh, my name is, it's, it's Philip. I, Philip, you look like you are very sad, Philip. Uh, I, 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 I've known love and it was ripped from me. Oh, that is one of the worst things you can ever experience. Yes. Yes. Simply because he is a prince, and I'm a stable master, and and also uh, we were struck with arrows. Suddenly, our love doesn't matter, I guess. Well, he was struck by an arrow. That that is so unusual. Oh, did you see who hit you with that arrow? Uh, yes, there was the there was the looked like a half orc in the tower, but uh, uh, it doesn't mean that my love is any less real. Oh, of course not. Of course not. From the tower, you said? The arrow oh, came from, from the, the tower? No, the parapet. I'm sorry. I'm so confused because of love. Yes. No, I yes. know the feeling. Oh, I, we were the at the parade and an arrow hit us and from on high. I assumed it was, it was Cupid again. Had you ever met the prince before today? I, I mean, I knew of him. Mm -hmm. I, I've seen him from afar, but oh. I didn't know I loved him till that day. Did you, you mentioned that it was a half-orc shooting the arrows. Did you yeah. notice anything else unusual about this uh, arrow-slinging half-orc? As soon as I looked into the eyes of my prince, I, I knew. I mean, I, I've seen that orc before. His name is uh, Sezak. Uh, you know, he's, he's kind of a, a rogue of, of uh, around town. He, mm. he does... Odd jobs here and there, some less than legal, but... Wait, you don't mean to say... He sounds a bit like a gadabout, but that can't possibly be the case. Uh, it's, I don't know, he's more of a mercenary, Oh, but... okay, good. Oh. Ooh. Hmm. 
but, but he may there was going to be He might may dabble and get about it. Well, I should hope not. Oh yes. <laughs> Do you need a, a license to do that? Uh, yes. A certificate yes. of some sort? Yes. You have to get one from the local business bureau. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's very important. Some mm-hmm. background checks and... Yes. He's worked many years mm-hmm. for his multiple degrees. I'm a 300-hour gadabout. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it's possible. Uh, he's, uh, he's, uh, he, he seems like he's always looking for a good time. Mm. Who is it, though? Who is it? Well, well, we well put, be Oras. to celebrate things, so yes. That's true. Well put. I mean, everyone <laughs> likes a good time, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Good times. Good times. Good times. Good times. Good times. Yeah. And Amos. He, he, I've seen him before. He, he, he climbed out of the sewers. And, <laughs> out of the sewers? Yes. And, and then, I don't know, he, he may have gone back there. I don't know. I was, I was so enthralled with my new love. Now I know he's not a gadabout, because no gadabout would spend so much time in so foul-smelling a locale. Oh, no, mm-hmm, no. Mm-hmm. Unless he had some way to make it smell less horrible. Hmm. Worth investigation, but yes. for now, good orc, we promise you, one way or another, we shall put your unrequited love to rest this crimson day. Oh, yes. Thank you. That's all I want is for... This pain to end and my love to return to me. Yes, well, your heart will heal. Yeah, definitely one of those two things is going to happen. <laughs> yes, yes. yes. Let me just say, your command of their language is pretty good. Oh, I was, I was born here, I don't... Oh. Orax, it was very nice of you to compliment that man it. on his language ability. It was very sweet, yes. You are very, very sweet and giving soul. I wanted to yell at him. <laughs> but you didn't, no. because you're learning. <gasps> yes. You've learned two things today, oh, Orax. No. Two things. Two things. Oh my. Well, I think we know what that I means. Think yes. We have to celebrate. Yes, we do. To two things. To two learning two things. things. Learning hammers. <laughs> and also hammers. <laughs> Must not forget the hammers. Hammers, I mean. Um. Uh, Thaddeus. Uh, yes. <laughs> of course. Ajax, bring the smaller bubbly carriage. <laughs> it detaches from the larger carriage. Uh, would, you, would you like to? Yeah. Yes, I'm already on it. <laughs> thank you. Stuart, happy Crimson Day to you. Oh, thank yes. you. Thank you. Let us pour you a glass of this as well. Oh, I couldn't. No, you must. Uh, oh, thank you. It, it is Crimson Day. Yes, uh, yes you must be all so kind to uh, tell old Stuart here. We're definitely going to celebrate this holiday we all just heard about today in the truest, most traditional way possible. Yes. The day after. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. We're a do over day. Yeah. Yes. Do over day. I've never heard of Crimson Day, but it's today now. Today is the mulligan of Crimson Day. Yes. Redo. All right. Shall we into the tower? Yes, I think so. I think this might be a good time for me to work on my uh, gentlemanly athletics. So while you all should climb the stairs, I believe I shall scale the outside. <laughs> oh, wow. Would you like help with scaling the outside? Oh, no. I, uh, I must do this myself. All right. This is part of my regimen. Of course. I've sunk a lot of points into climbing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see how it works out. I rolled a 19. Okay. No, I'm sorry. A 22. Okay. With a four. With a four. <laughs> With a four. <laughs> yeah. Okay. He's level 19. All right. Yeah. I'm level, yes. <laughs> so, so you just, I mean, Orax is the, probably the most impressed, and Steward as well. Yeah, you see him, there's a tiny... Hippity, n- hop. N- no, yeah. Goes, <laughs> uh, and he's like, seems like he's like, he's like one-arming it, and then uh, throwing himself up. <laughs> like, he's just like, like... Like crazy climbing strength. I just, I just lean over to Stuart. Well, you see the, the handholds. It's it's much easier with handholds. Oh. You see the bricks are kind of broken there, so it's, okay. yeah, I can do that. Ah, Orax Green is not a good color on you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm all green. Ah, you get it. <laughs> I think you look lovely in green. Thank you. It looks nice. Thank you. It's, Shall we? <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. After you. After you. Yes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> well, um, we'll go in together then. Yes. 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 So you make way in the tower, climbing the, the spiral staircase uh, towards the top. Uh, obviously, Thaddeus is there first. <laughs> like just as you start to like <clears throat> climb, like get to the last level, you see him like literally just like backflip in, in through the window. Ta! <laughs> oh, very good. Very good. Yes. <clears throat> Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. And in I here. wipe a very thin trickle of perspiration off of my forehead. Do you need to re-up on your antiperspirant? <laughs> I might. <laughs> yes. Re- 
party. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Good. Perfect. Yes. So uh, the the top floor is uh, there. There's one single sort of uh, very large, uh, somewhat ornate door that has one, one guard standing in front of it. It's like, oh, hi. Um, I, who are you? We are here to uh, discuss some matters with the prince. We have permission. Yes, the king sent us. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'll have you roll some sort of persuasion. It's going to be a bluff. Oh, wait, you're, li- you're going to lie to him? Yeah. Do it. Tell him a good one, though. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> table reroll? Yeah, yeah. table one. Yeah. I rolled one. a natural one, yeah. so. Let's redo. That just will not do. Okay. So, what was I rolling? Okay, so that is a 19. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What, what are you saying then? You see, we are here to investigate this little uh, uh, love triangle that seems to have appeared within the palace. And so, um, we need to discuss some matters with the prince privately. You know, matters of the heart must be kept close to the heart. So, if you could just go ahead and work your way all the way back down the stairs, Go through the front door, close the front door, and then just wait there. And uh, if you don't see us exit, that's probably also fine. Just continue waiting. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> I'd say oh. that's worth at least a 98th percentile on her quarterly evaluation. Oh, yes, I think so. It was very good. Yes. That's a very good job. Yeah, well done. I think, I think oh. that, uh, uh, yep. you know, uh, it's a very good thing to celebrate. Yes, yes. way to confuse that guard. <laughs> good job confusing. I nearly confused myself. Oh, wow. And hammers. You know, I could have... Always hammers. I could have just let us... I could have just talked to him, but that was that was impressive. <laughs> it's important that we keep our skills sharp, Stuart. Yes. yes. Mm-hmm, okay. Mm-hmm. I need to practice. Good to know. I'm only a level seven, after all. Um... Is this door locked? Uh, <laughs> only from the outside. Mm. Oh, well, that's lucky for us, right? Mm. We have keys? Yeah. Great. Well, the, no, it's like just a, a dead boat. Like, you could literally just, just turn like it. like unlock it? Yeah. I don't understand the mechanism behind this door, Stuart. Could you show us oh, it's how it... Yeah, you just turn this, and mm-hmm. then, then the knob will turn. <gasps> oh, that's very clever. That's very convenient. clever. That's nice. so clever. Because very you can lock convenient. it from one side. Yes, yes, uh, yes. A very high-level wizard, probably, for that. Oh, wait, though. If the prince wanted to be in this room, why would it be locked from the outside? He, he doesn't want to be in this room. Yeah, well, I, th- I think he I wants think, to be with his... his yeah, I um, think, I think they trapped him number. so he couldn't be with the guy downstairs. Yeah. Well, now I'm conflicted mm. because love even brought on through deception mm. is still something to be celebrated and enjoyed. Well... <sighs> I mean, as long as I'm both into it, right? Well, right. they are, but what about um, the prince he was supposed to marry? What if he is heartbroken by this mm. this arrow that That's came true. out of nowhere? So it's quite the conundrum. Listen, also, I feel like I can't right. stress enough that this will lead to uh, nationwide war. Yes, oh. there's also mm. there is that. Very there important. Is that. Definitely a footnote worth noting. Yes, human yes. lives. I could bring the tribes of the other council and down and they could uh, essentially eliminate both kingdoms. No, that probably uh, is too strong a solution, yes. Orax. I would say that's a jumping the gun. Let's just put it out as an option. Well, sure, yeah, we'll okay, call that option C. Nice. contributing yes. ideas. Yes, you are contributing. It's very good. Very good job. Well done. With that, yes. Mm-hmm. Um, so should we go in then? Of course, after you, Wait, Jocelyn. Uh, well, uh, no, no, after you, of course. Uh, Luna. Oh, I couldn't possibly please have to. Or actually just kind of <laughs> shoves his way through. <laughs> oh, well, perfect. It's a large one, then. <laughs> well, I'll say this door's probably yes. smaller. I was like, yeah. it's so important. So as Orax is shoving his way through, he probably <laughs> sort of jostles us in. through yeah. the doorway oh, as well. well uh, oh, all right. Oh, oh, oh uh, here we are. Orax as well. <clears throat> so you enter the room. It's, it's, <laughs> it's somewhat modestly for royalty furnished, but, you know, still better than most common folk would live. Uh, and, and so just a couple clown paintings? Yeah, just a couple <laughs> clown paintings. <laughs> oh, and oh, then, they're the just so romantic. As you see, oh, so as you see one of the more depressing clown paintings, you see a, a, a younger man with a very long hair like in his face, and he's just like, oh, what's even the point? <laughs> oh, you sound so sad. Yeah, it's just, <laughs> it's so hard, you mm. know, I, because like, you know, I was, I was seeing this this guy for a while, but then like I met someone new, and then my dad got so angry. Oh, 
about the guy you were seeing. Tell me more about him. Oh, he's, a, he's a prince of a neighboring kingdom. He gave me a horse that got elf ears. Oh, oh it sounds wonderful. so lovely. How rare. <laughs> yeah, it's quite. It was expensive. I, was, I really like it because it, it looks super weird. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. right. He sounds like he likes you a lot. Yeah. And I thought I liked him until Crimson Day, and apparently I'm in love with uh, the stable master. And, and had you ever spoken to the stable no, master never, before? No, never seen him or mm. laid eyes on him before. I, I normally wouldn't even consort with someone like that. Mm. Crimson Day has a way of doing mm. funny things to a person. I know, right? Yeah. My dad got all like, uh, you can't do it. Uh, he's got an eye patch. Oh, yes, yes, oh, he did. It's a good impression <laughs> despite the right. lack of eye patch. And the eye patch is quite dashing, actually. Uh, yes, it is. Well, uh, on you, uh, Crimson Day, uh, yesterday, do you remember what happened? Because you, you were marrying this other, this, 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 this prince, and then yeah, everything it was, changed. It was like supposed to be like a big celebration because the, the, the wedding's next week, and like. I was I was like on the parade float and everything was fine. I was riding my horse um, with the, the elf ears. Uh, it was it was really cool. And then like I was like feeling really good about myself. And then I felt like this pinch. And I look and I'm like there's an arrow for a second, but it went away. Mm. And then I my eyes locked with my true love. Mm. Oh. Let's see. Well, did did you see? So you didn't see anything before the pin. You didn't see where this arrow came from. No, I mean it just hit me, and then like I was screaming, but I I was so enthralled with my love that I just you know. I... Whiplash. Thank Whiplash. You, Whiplash. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much for the tip. Um, do you mind, your highness? Uh, where was it that the arrow struck you? Right in the shoulder. Could we see the wound? Sure. Oh. Yeah, I guess no, don't, oh, Orax, I know you've got a weak stomach, but yes. mm. don't worry. Uh, hold on, let me take this. And, and then Stuart's like, all right, let, let me help you, sir. <laughs> uh, These clothes are difficult to yeah. uh, if A lot of layers. And I recommend tear away sleeves. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or a friendly spider. Yes, friendly spiders you. are quite helpful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, we just have Stuart. <laughs> Stuart is, Stuart is very close second. Yes, close second. Close second. Yeah, it's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. Uh -huh. So eventually he gets. He gets <laughs> He's probably the, part spider somewhere back in his family probably. tree. Eventually he gets the the shirt undone enough so he can show the shoulder. And there's a little. It looks like just kind of, a, almost a bruise, but it's heart shaped. Hmm. Well, it's an adorable wound. Oh yes, it's lovely. Yes, it's very cute. Does anyone have a way to identify anything else about this wound? Because mm. uh, cinnamon and biscuits, I sure don't. Well, if only somebody had a piece of an arrow. Oh, <laughs> wait, yes! You do have that piece of an arrow, don't you? And you dramatically revealed it at an appropriate time! Oh, she's laughing well, so well! Done, well done. One thing, yes, one thing. You will level up any time now. <laughs> <laughs> so what do I do with the arrow? I don't know. What do you want to do? I don't know. Maybe maybe hold um, it up to the wound and yes, see if it's a match. Does anything happen? As you hold it up, you hear... You, <laughs> My you, hand, I'm There's sure. a faint, like... I'm appearing in the thing. And you see, like, a little... Like, the, the, the wound, like, sort of glow a little bit. And the arrow smells just like champagne. <gasps> oh, my. Well, that was nice. Yes. <gasps> it's weird. Uh, yes, it's also weird. It was... Amazing, but it was quite. I'm amazing. going to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, now do it a little bit further Lovely. away, and then closer, but then a little further away. <laughs> oh, it's definitely definitely the arrow. Yes, it's the arrow. Yep. It could be a new musical instrument of some sort. <laughs> it's like the the theremin, but love. Uh, maybe yeah. I'll write a song about how life sucks now. Oh, 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 come hey, on. Don't, don't hey, do that. now don't listen. Do uh oh. That. Listen. Orax has pulled out his soapbox. You have, you know what? It doesn't matter who you love. If they love you back, that's all that matters. That's what I said. Exactly. But you have to pick yourself up. You can't wallow in your own uh, demise or, 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 or sadness or anything. If, if you, what you have to do is you have to pick yourself up and you have to. You have to face the music, and you have to live your life the best way you know how. Oh, can all I, right. Can I roll an intimidate check? <laughs> <laughs> that's all I wanted to do. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Uh, that's a 29. Okay. He's trying so hard. He oh, is. Quite, yeah. Look at how well it's working out for him. <laughs> Just like right over his face. <laughs> 
All right, uh, all right, man, I'll stop being, uh... S- no s- more sad sacking! Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's unbecoming of a prince. You're, you're right. And he takes a clown painting and he chucks it out the window. <gasps> That's oh, right! Oh, oh, that was wow. very dramatic. Oh, yes, it was. I thought I was going to miss it, but the room feels a little bit brighter now. Yeah, it does. Listen, we're going to go investigate, see if we can set up some healing for your broken heart. But in the meantime, I think you should relax. Maybe take yourself a nice bubble bath. Ooh. Oh yes, that does this sound is, lovely. Yes, it does. I, I don't. I don't think I have any. Oh, I've. I've actually. Uh, yeah. <laughs> wait. <laughs> we need a prop. Oh yes. Oh wait. Hold on. I think I know what you're talking about, Luna. A prop. A prop. Mm, props. Props are very important. <laughs> Could you pass that to Luna, please? Yes. Uh. <laughs> because I am very silly. <laughs> so. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm going to use this arrow! Oh! Ah. This is what uh, five full-grown adults do with their money. Yes. Correct. 100% correct. Three of which are gentle people. Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. 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 Just, you know, like, apart. not over the table. Yeah. <laughs> right. Just yes, like, Orax. Just like the very expensive <laughs> table in our carriage, yes. we have to assume that everyone's table is very expensive. I don't yes. want to speak for the prince, but I'm just assuming. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it, it's it's very, uh, you know, it's like super, it costs my dad money and get angry if we don't. Uh. All right, um, Luna goes into his quarters and prepares a nice bubble bath. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, oh. it almost went right in there. I'm blowing this way. There you go. There it is. Oh. Nice is. bubble bath. There we are. Yeah, he's sort of... He, don't you feel calmer now? <laughs> he sort of sinks into it. He's like, oh. Yeah, this is, this is better. Yeah. Thanks. We got two more of these, so... <laughs> enjoy that bubble. Help so yourself. Bubbles. Mm-hmm. That was a lot of work for a very little little bit, but I hope that all of you enjoyed it. I, I very much did. I did. <laughs> I did. So, should we go and speak with this, um... Sizak, uh, I think. Sizak, Sizak, uh, yes, yes. Seems like a prudent one to go after. I agree, Jocelyn. Well planned and well stated. Oh, thank you. Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, um, I enjoy your bubble bath. I will. Wonderful. And, um, uh, chin up. Yes. Oh, okay. Uh, above the water. Okay. Don't. No, no, we got I one know. of the accidents. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Please don't yell at me again. Yes, he, he, we, we can't control him, so he might if you don't uh, follow what he wants you to do. Yeah. Um, are you going to be taking uh, the same way down? You know, I believe I shall. <laughs> uh, we'll take the stairs, I think. Hippity hop. <laughs> I rolled a 29. Okay. <laughs> you literally just go, whoop. <laughs> like, it's, they're not you sure. You just sort of, like, if... bounce down the wall a little bit. Yeah. Like, <laughs> and repelling, <laughs> but with no row. Yeah. And, and remember, you can't spell slaughter without laughter. I don't get it. It doesn't sound the same. Anyway, don't forget it. I, I, I won't. Hmm. And he tries to. Shall we go? I think we should. Yes, I think Don't you so. just hate it when people answer their own questions? I do. Mm. <laughs> oh, yes. She does. She says that often. Oh. I'm not here. <laughs> yes, but yeah. I'm all the way down I'm here. I'm just the clown painting I'm addressing. <laughs> 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 it's so romantic. Hey, Avenger. Yeah. Yeah. Thank, 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 thank you for the subscription. We appreciate that. You can know. only assume you have a Hulk. Let us know about those re-rolls, everyone who subbed. Um, or you can hold on to them for any of our other shows mm-hmm. throughout. Does Orax need bubbly? Oh, he does. My goodness, Orax, Orax why Orax didn't you doesn't. pipe up sooner? <laughs> but Dom might like some sparkling cider. <laughs> We're running a bit low, everyone. Where's the other one? Why, it's being refrigerated <laughs> in the fridge. What? We didn't plan this out well. I could get it. Shall you get it? <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Orax, could you be a deer and grab us another... Uh... This one's mine. Yep. Let me go tell Ajax to go get the other one. Yes, please do. Ah, Stuart can help. Okay, Stuart. <laughs> Stuart the steward. All right, so Sizax is the half-orc that we're looking for. Yes, and yeah. seemingly likes cheese. And mm. having a good time. And sewers. 
Right. Oh, so sewers. Those uh, are a few places where we could start. Oh. Orax is going to be very disappointed to hear that he enjoys sewer cheese. <laughs> That's oh. one of Orax's oh. least favorite it's cheeses. It's one of the most pungent cheeses. Yes. Quite. One of the worst ones, I'd say. Right. Well, perhaps we should uh, just pick any sewer opening and just pop in and have a look around. Uh, maybe we can just uh, shout in first. So can we I have to go down there? instead make a perception check? <laughs> yes. To see if maybe one of the manholes, I'm assuming, has been disturbed recently. Oh That's my. the second one I've rolled. A we've, natural one. We've got table rerolls. We're real for Sam. Should we yeah. use that for a perception? No, let's all roll perception. Okay, yeah. okay. let's do that instead. Where's my perception? Oh perception wow, I already. actually did okay. I got an 11. Nice. Hold on. I would like to explain this sudden ability to perceive in-game. Mm. I would like to take two minutes and I would like to change into one of my other gentlemanly <gasps> wardrobe options. Oh yes. my. So I would like to don a towel, <laughs> just a towel, <laughs> artfully placed to conceal all of my gentlemanly bits. And this will give me a bonus to my wisdom roll, mm. but a 45% chance of gabbing way too much. Mm. So I rolled a 36. <laughs> What did you see, that? Oh wait, I'm sorry, not a 36. <laughs> that was way too high. <laughs> no, I was like, oh That's my God. bonkers. <laughs> 26. <laughs> 26. The well, towel is you good. You carried the one yeah. twice. But the towel is not that good. What is that towel made out of? <laughs> well, I'll tell you in great detail what the towel is made out oh of. Oh my. Because I rolled over that percentile. <laughs> so the towel is made out of terry cloth and also bits of rayon and a little bit of polyester and some nylon. Uh, although it's primarily Egyptian cotton, I don't know, I probably should have led with that because you probably probably should that's have what it's mostly made out of. However, you're going to want to, hold on, Jocelyn, I'm not quite finished. <laughs> you're going to want to uh, not dry this uh, because even though it is a little bit artificial fabric and then some natural fabric, Fabric. It will shrink a bit in the wash. Is there, so is you... there a gold thread in there? Oh yes, no, I believe it is. I hadn't oh, noticed. I uh, bought it off the rack. I'm sorry to but... interrupt, but we really should probably go into. Uh, yes. Oh my god, I am going on. I yes, should change are. back into my suit. I don't know what it is about the towel that just makes me speak at length. Uh, you, it's uh, more comfortable, maybe. Mm. I... I'll only be two minutes. Right. And I change back into my suit. Well, in in that time when you were when you felt yourself the most connected to the world because you were exposing your, your, your gentlemanly ways as <laughs> much as, as, as decently possible to, mm -hmm. uh, you, you realized that when you were at the, 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 the failed uh, parade looking around, that there was, there was a manhole that looked like it was ajar slightly. Mm. Everyone, I've had a recollection. Oh, yeah. what is it? Something about the, the cool breeze I could feel just everywhere. Mm. Uh, I believe back at the festival, there was a slightly ajar manhole cover. <gasps> oh my. Well, we should start there. Yes, we should indeed. And Let's uh, celebrate this recollection. Oh. Yes. Yes, oh. it's very good. To recalling things. To, to recalling things, to recall. yes. Remembering events past. And hammers. Yes, Orax had hammers. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys make your way into the, uh, the sewers, I assume? Um, I'm, I'm sure it takes us several minutes to decide who goes yes. down. Well, I thought, first. didn't Jocelyn want us to call down, call down first? first. Oh. Then go for it. Just give them a sporting uh, heads up. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a Sazak down here? Uh, a Sizak, I believe. Oh, I'm sorry. Sizak. I, I, I apologize for mispronouncing your name. Uh, you hear? No. Mm. I, I, well, I, I don't buy I jump it. down like just <laughs> fall, fall, oh. fall oh. down. Oh, oh, Orax has plummeted into the sewer. Oh, yes. We should go after him. We can't leave him alone down there. Yes. Time is of the essence oh, after right. both of you. Oh, no, 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 after you. No, we have no time to waste after you. Oh, please. No, no, you must go first. No, no, as please. As yes, she's mean. right. After you, Orax could be in danger. After you. Oh, uh, well, you know what? You are the mentor. You are the eldest. No, 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 no. You must go first. Listen, I would, I would feel just so terrible if anything bad were to happen to both of you while I went down there and you remained up here. Please, after you. Oh no, but but I must stay up here and make sure no one tries to attack us. So you all must go first. Can we still see Orax? <laughs> uh, I don't know. What what is Orax doing? Uh, Orax goes uh, just just. Leaps down, full, doesn't even climb, and just just drops down into the sewer and just starts 
Oh, oi. it was newly cleared out. <laughs> right. Whole factory zone. Yeah. Um, uh, oi. Who, who's, who responded when she said Sizak? <laughs> uh, no, nobody. Oh. What? Can you see him? No right? one's here. Wait. Is it a oh. goblin? I love cats. <laughs> Are you a goblin? Uh, no. There's, oh, I'm, nobody down here. Don't keep. Uh, there's certainly no traps. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, that's reassuring. That is reassuring. I'll go down. <laughs> oh yes, yes, please. Oh yes, of course. Do so. Of course, yes. <laughs> All right, I finally, I finally jumped down into the sewer. All right, Jocelyn. Now uh, after your mentee. Well, okay. If we're going not water, then. <laughs> Hippity hop. <laughs> <laughs> so, so you all uh, enter into the sewer. Yes. yes. All right. Somehow we still smell great. Oh yeah. Um, so I start moving towards the voice, the, right. the disembodied voice. I'm I gonna have. have you roll perception. Great. <clears throat> Uh, here we go. Uh, let's see. That's um, a twenty-one. Okay. Orax, what do your af orc eyes see? <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> you you notice like a, there's a lot of like a sewer. It's very disgusting. A lot of like weird gunk and and stuff like that. But then you notice just in front of you that there is sort of a it, it if you weren't actively looking you would think it's just more like sludge or something like that but then you realize that this is probably some sort of ooze creature in front of you oh. and it could have had the drop on you but you notice it nice try ooze creature <gasps> ooze creature ooze. yeah you yep you know that could have gone another way it's I'm not going with to me right the fact that we did not have to have a surprise oh. around yeah. Yeah, I don't, is, I don't this, know if there's this ooze. okay <laughs> Yep, yep. It, to not being surprised. To not being surprised, <laughs> yes. Yep. So you have successfully not uh, avoided a, a surprise round from, from a, an ooze, but uh, certainly your celebration has caused you not to be able to gain surprise <laughs> against it. Uh, so I'm going to have everyone roll initiative. Well, that would be oh, unsporting oh, of yes. us. <laughs> initiative! Oh, oh, love to waste my natural 20 on initiative. <laughs> <Nice>. <clears throat> Um, that's pretty high. Are you ready for our shativs? Yes. I have a 15. I got 15. a 24. I also have a 24. Ooh. 18. Damn, you all. Okay. <laughs> so it's, well, it was 15. Wait, we add dex modifier to initiative? Yes. Right? So I'm a 25. Actually. And did you, and you also added your improved initiative I did. bonus. Great. And then Orax was... 18. 18, okay. But I'm adding my orc blood to it. Mm. It does nothing to initiative. Mm. He just cuts himself a little. <laughs> Makes him go fast. All right. <laughs> Gets Gotta rid go. of all that extra blood weight he's Gotta carrying go around. Gotta go fast. <laughs> all right, so uh, it is Jocelyn up first. I, I assumed I was like, ooh, I rolled... I rolled a 14, I'm gonna be the de no. I think actually with the dex bonus, Luna goes yeah. first. Oh, oh. oh. yes. Okay, I, I just assumed with a higher level, but yeah, okay, Luna then. Does it seem hostile? Yes. <laughs> As we've already rolled initiative. No, I seems super cool, super chill. It's just like super chill. Hey guys, how's it going? All right, oh. I don't want to approach this because I don't want to get filthy. And also I'm wearing heels. Yes, also <laughs> Luna. So. As, as your grand mentor, <laughs> yes, I feel like now would be a great time to point out that uh, you have the ability to use your after you initiative, gentle gentle person <gasps> ability as well. I do. Mm -hmm. That's fun. Let's do that, please. After you. Oh, why? Thank you very much. So now I have transferred first initiative to Thaddeus. All right. I will pick up after he is done. Thaddeus, you up? All right. Well, since she was kind enough to <laughs> transfer me up to here, I, I turn to her very briefly and I say, what's your, what's your move here, Luna? I'm going to shoot it with a cork. <laughs> All right, but before you do, let me show you my love moves. <gasps> <laughs> so I'm gonna add a 5d6 bonus to her next attack roll. Okay. Uh, so that's eight, 11, 12. You get a plus 12 to your attack roll. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Um, That's just for the one time, right? Uh, yes. Just the one attack. Okay. Uh, and then 
So I I have several attack bonuses. So am I allowed to use special abilities multiple times as well? I have, I technically have several attacks I can make in a in a round. And it's been a while since I've played Pathfinder. Uh yeah, I mean, what is the I just want to make one more move. I don't want to I don't want to really milk yeah, this. Well, yeah, sure. I'll I'll say that cuz you're not moving and I'll, I'll allow that. You're level 19, and I'm sure that's... Sure. Yeah. So I, I just want to turn and face the ooze, and I want to say, Hey, ooze, there are no men like me. Only me. <laughs> <laughs> and it needs to succeed on a wisdom saving throw. All right. Versus a 29, I think. Mm. Okay. Where's that? Uh, I'm, sure punch, that's, I'm using the punchline special so ability. I know you are, but where'd you get the 29? All right, so it needed a 29? <laughs> yes. Okay, it... it uh, with its plus one wisdom, rolled 20, so it failed. Okay. Um, so it's going to take 6d4 damage. Oh, damn. From and, my, from my punchline. And have a negative on its next attack, right? Yes, a negative two. Okay, we'll hold see on. see if it gets a chance hold to Hold on, d4s. <laughs> d4s. So six. 10. 15. My, uh, 15 damage? 15 damage from my humorous quip. All right. Good solid round. Luna, you are up. I'm going to remove my ranged weapon, which is a sling that shoots all of my accumulated champagne and wine corks. We've opened several bottles today. Yes. I have a pretty good supply. So I will be rolling. Okay. A 15. But plus 12. No, plus 12, yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay. So higher than that. Yeah, 30, so 27. What? 15 plus 12. Yeah, 27. 27. Like I said, Hit. I also carried the one twice. <laughs> <laughs> we do maths here on Saving That is a Throw. solid hit. A solid hit, he says. Okay. Um, good news. I don't do very much damage. That is three, right? <laughs> That's just it. <laughs> Turns out champagne corks, <laughs> not the hardest thing that you can sling at some point. Was it enough to take him down? No. Dang it. You see a champagne cork <laughs> floating in, in the earth and slowly gets like drawn into the center. Oh, oh my. Right. I forgot about ooze. <laughs> well shot, Luna. Thank you, Thaddeus. All right, uh, that uh, Jocelyn okay. is now up. I'm going to pull out my bow and pull it back, and I'm going to say, I'm pretty sober, but I'm prettier drunk, and then let, and then shoot it with my bow. So I'm essentially taking both of my attacks here. Yeah. Uh, so you're going to punchline it? Yes, yeah, so I'm going to punchline it. Um, so that's uh, wisdom, say, versus 26. Oh, I get it. Fail. <laughs> Fail. OK, so that's 5d4 damage. Don't worry, you'll get to 64 one day, Jocelyn. Oh, I know. Can't be too far. So that was three, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Wow. Uh, 17 uh, damage and has a, an another minus two okay. on its next attack. And then for my um, weapon, uh, so I'm, I would be using... The fir yeah, the first one. The first one? Okay. Or no, the second the one, because you, one. yeah. Um, so that's 18. Okay, that's a hit. Okay, and then uh, 1d8. Where's my d8? Careful, your shawl is getting in your bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> that happens sometimes. That's not a d8. Where's my d8? Here you go, take mine. <laughs> uh, I also do a whole lot of damage for five. Five damage. <laughs> <laughs> our wit bites much harder than the steel of our weapon. Yes. yes. All right. We're so. lovers, not fighters. All right. Orax. Um, because I used my squee ability in response to Thaddeus's, I'm going to give plus 11 to your attack. Oh, all right. Uh, so, so, I mean, you can roll, but it, it would be an automatic hit. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's just see if I crit. Yeah. yeah. So basically, we just hit over and over again, but then we're just like, tink, <laughs> yeah, tink, yep. tink, yep. tink. We'll get him eventually. Um, no. Uh, it's, it's a uh, twenty-eight. Yes. Yeah. No. A tw yeah, twenty-eight plus uh, uh, thirty-five. Mm. Look at him try, lady. Oh, uh, trying so, so hard. Actually, so hard. So well. That's a miss. <laughs> 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 Uh, uh, and he goes, uh, that's not a hammer. Get your hammer. 
Anything happen? X. Nothing happened. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, and and he just uh, brings it down. Yep. Um, into the ooze. Into the ooze. All right. That's eight. For eight damage. All right. Good job. <laughs> Thank you very much, GM's person. Yes. <laughs> GM's person. Yes. All right. So you. you You've walloped it fairly well, but it's still it's still up and running, and it's like starts vibrating, and it um, it only gets the one attack, I assume. Um, <laughs> well, so, it's not level nineteen. Yeah, so. It's a, it, yeah. So it uh, it it uses it, like it sprouts sort of a tentacle and just comes whacking at uh, you. The the most I mean the, I mean clearly <laughs> the one standing in the forefront, the most impressive mm. of of you. My hair is the bluest. Yeah, mm. so not the purplest. But the bluest. That would be me. So it, 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 it goes and, and tries to smack at you uh, and slam you with its attack. It's jealous of um, your biceps. Does a 20... F- oh, no. Uh, what's your armor class? 19. Uh, <laughs> because so, I'm wearing my gentlemanly uniform. Yeah, so it, it would hit with doing some math. Uh, I think it just hits with its minus I'm going four. to use, I'd take a bullet for you, man. Okay. And, and uh, I have my bow and I'm just going to like, I'm going to throw it up and it's going to uh, like hook back on my back and I'm going to jump daintily in front of him. Oh, lovely. I've got this! <laughs> and uh, for this, uh, I, the, I take the attack for no damage. Mm-hmm. Uh, I can see you and now I'm going to remain in your spot and um, just file my nails. Yeah. So it like goes and like, like, m- you just sort of like deflect the like tentacle and it goes. <laughs> and it's, it's, you can't attack my mentor. Thank you so much, Jocelyn. Oh, of course, any time. I would always be there for you. Yes, I appreciate it. I would yes. have gotten all icky. Oh, I know. We can't have that. that no. Is very chivalrous. Oh, yeah. thank you, thank you. So that's uh, the end of its turn. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I assume Thaddeus is still in the front mm. now because. Yeah, it's the permanent change yeah. in the initiative oh. order. Um, okay. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try and pull out my gnomish greatsword. Yes. Mm. I don't know if that's a real thing. No, it is. But it's just a, is it? It's just a short okay. sword. Because in, pa- in the <laughs> Pathfinder rules, by it said any any item that has no more gnomish in the name, I can treat as a martial weapon. <laughs> yeah. so, you've made, you've so I called it a gnomish greatsword. Yeah. But really, I call it Slicey Guy, mm. and I pull it out from somewhere in my suit, two-handed sword, and I say. Uh, all right, slicey guy. Let's slice and dice this guy. I'm going to attack. Yeah. Not a catchphrase yet. Nope. Nope. Not yet. Uh, I rolled a 19, which is potentially a critical hit. Uh, so I have to confirm this critical. Okay. That's an 18 plus 19. So does a <laughs> 37 hit. Just barely. Okay. <laughs> so that's going to be a critical hit. Yeah. Okay. So I get to seven. Nine, 16, 17 damage. Oh, somebody nice. actually does some damage. Well, I crit, so. <laughs> there is that. Very yeah. solid round of hits from Thaddeus. Uh, Luna. Well, my cork didn't seem to do as much as I wanted it to. So I'm going to pull out one of my daggers that does the same damage, but I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll take out one of my daggers and I'll say, the first cut is the deepest, <laughs> and lunge for the ooze. Lunge. That's what we do. We do lunges. You do curls. Lunge, Luna, you lunge. Do lunges. All right. Okay. That's not great. It's a nine. Oh, I forgot to bolster you with my love moves. Total? <laughs> yeah. That's a miss. Dang it. Dang it. Don't be disheartened, Luna. You're doing great. Thank you. I'm trying. Not as hard as, as Rx, but I am trying. All right, Jocelyn. Uh, I'm going to um, I'm going to pull out my rapier, uh, Darren, and before <laughs> Darren, <laughs> Darren, and before I attack this thing, I'm going to turn to Orax and say, "Is that a dagger in your pocket? Or are you just happy to see me?" You know I have a dagger in my pocket. <laughs> Yes, that's right. There's two of them. Me. Never hurts Always to ask it. Orax. Yes, so you never just hurts. Eat it when people answer their own questions. <laughs> I do. Yes. Okay, and I'm gonna give you five d6 bonus on your uh, next attack. Thirteen. <laughs> Ten, Thirteen. Uh, Twenty-four to your next attack. 
Just a plus 24. So <laughs> for Orax. For Orax. Yeah. So I get it. I get an automatic plus uh, 33. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It, that might It might make be it. okay. You could still uh, roll it a might one. Make it work. So I'm going to uh, attack with my rapier now. Uh, <laughs> so I guess I get this bonus. Mm -hmm. I have four attacks. Yeah, but it would be rude to take all of your attacks <laughs> against this ooze. It would be rude. Um, so what is that? A 22? Hit. Uh, Wait, would you? Oh, you rolled a nine. Okay. Yeah, I rolled a nine. For uh, six damage. <laughs> we're doing so well. But guys, we look so good yeah, we when are. we're attacking. Really? Oh, yes. I feel like very maybe very that's not being it's properly very, conveyed. I mean, you're very Errol Flynn, like you're just toying with it at this point. Uh -huh. yep. <laughs> yes, just toying with it. <laughs> that's exactly what we're Waiting doing. to bring our full abilities to yes. bear. Yes. All right. Orax? All right. You can't spell slaughter without laughter. <laughs> Still don't get that one. Um, it's we joke. didn't come up with it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you came up with it. I mean, slaughter, <coughs> laughter. It's just a, it's. Slaughter, laughter. The one word, has an F in it's it. It's a word joke. <laughs> it doesn't talk. Yeah. It, it, it makes yeah, more sense if you see it written. Mm. Mm. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I can't read it. Oh, that's a part, part uh, of the that's a good thing you're trying so hard. That's a four, one of those dice rolls. That's a, a forty-five. One. Yeah, it just barely. <laughs> just barely hits. <laughs> good. Okay. Oh, that's max, max. damage. Oh. Uh, that's 16. Nice, solid hit. <laughs> Is it dead? Confound Not yet. Ooze. Oh. But wow. it's very angry at you, so it goes. Oh, oh. oh well that. fought, Ooze. Well fought. Yeah, bring it. Uh, it's, uh, that is a. Uh, You're trying to make me mad. That is a 21? 21. 20, 21 hits. Okay. <laughs> but I see that about that, that is about to happen, mm. and I go, no, <laughs> in unnecessarily slow motion, yeah. and dive in front Memo. of Orax and the ooze. And as I'm passing in front of it, I just very lightly slap it in its face <laughs> analog. Yeah, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I take the attack for no damage. You yeah. Need a snow cone after that. Nope, mine was the playful slap in the oh, face okay. analog. That was my cool, chill thing yeah, that I did while doing it. Yeah. All right, you, you smack it away. Okay, and it is now your turn. <laughs> and I'm standing in between it and Orax. Yeah. All right. And I'm all... Don't worry, Orax. Oh. We're here to keep you from getting all icky. E oh, yes, okay. very important. Thanks. Okay. Perhaps, Luna, you've forgotten my love moves. Here, let me show you them. <laughs> my love moves. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Six. <laughs> Ten. 11. Plus 11 okay. to your next attack roll. I think I've got it now. All right. Yes. Very good. You know what? I think this thing is pretty on the ropes. <laughs> Why don't you go ahead and... Ah, oh, what the hey? I'll hit it one more time. <laughs> Why not? Okay. A 31? Hits? Yes. <laughs> Eric. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'll send this ooze after him. That'll do it. For, really. for 10 damage. 10 damage. All right. A very solid hit. Slicey guy. <laughs> he slice away. Uh, it's not looking great, this this ooze, but it's still slightly, it's still up. It's struggling to hold its form. Luna. Mm. There, I cut some dagger-shaped slots in it for you to <laughs> fill, Luna. <laughs> I'll fill him with cork. That's what I'll do. Mm. Does an 11 hit him? It does. No well, plus, a, plus 11. 22 hit him? <laughs> oh, in that case. <laughs> nope. It goes too far and yeah. doesn't yeah. hit him. Wait, I'm sorry, yes? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We must be explicit here. We don't want to presume. Okay. <laughs> one damage to take it down! Uh, you know, one damage is not to uh, quite... To take it down! Not quite enough. Um, still kind of holding on. Yeah, it's still kind of holding Dang on. It. What did you roll back there? <laughs> <laughs> is the you still holding on? Yes, it is. I just, I, I, I stole that from Tom. I'm just like, yeah, sure, I already made my decision. No, yeah, uh, I rolled the dice, though, so yeah, yeah. So it's official now. Yeah. Well, he is using dice, so yeah. we have to listen. Very All true. right, Jocelyn. All right, uh, I will attack it with um, Darren again, my rapier. Mm -hmm. and, uh, oh, that is a potentially a critical hit. Oh, yes, hit. it yeah. is. Uh, so you roll again to confirm it. Yes, me. I did not. No, that's a 29. What? Does a 29 hit? Yes. You but crit it's... it. 
Don't I have to roll a 15 to 20 again to... No, so it's if you roll a 15 or 20 for your first attack, 15 through to, 20. You just have to confirm that you would hit it normally. Oh, I did not understand that. Yes. Okay, no. uh, then yes. 2d6 plus 2 now. 2d6. Yes, we have a Pathfinder tutorial series on YouTube. You can... <laughs> Perhaps some of us uh, should have watched it before we started this game. That would have been helpful for me. No, we uh, were three very busy now. deciding how best to be fancy. And yes, nine. Nine, nine. nine damage. Very, yes. very solid. Taking a very nice swipe out of him, uh, and uh, he's still slightly up, and it's Orax's turn. You critical oh, Darren! Oh, before, before it's Orax's turn, I want to say, are you sure? Is that a dagger in your pocket, or are you just happy? To Why do you keep <laughs> saying that? Yes. Oh, I just Look. have to check. Well, it's you just check, yeah. Orax. It's just, just two just, daggers. She's just, gonna keep asking. <laughs> uh, ten. Uh, sixteen plus sixteen. <laughs> All right. Let's just see if I crit. Yeah. Uh, you said 16? Yeah. So, uh, 41. Okay. Is that? Yeah, that's <laughs> close. It's close. I'll Within the realm of I'll possibility. Give it to you. Yeah. I'll give it to you. You're a kind GM person. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's a, that's a 12. 12. You slice this thing in twain. It, it, it he loses. He sliced it in oh. twain! Oh it, my. It, it slowly, like, ripples and then <laughs> and then <coughs> dissolves and then like some some gunk gets on you <gasps> but none no, of it gets no, on us no just just all right oh that could have been very unpleasant oh um, oh can i use my pleasurable smells to to heal 1d12 no stuff for please, him please oh, absolutely please, yes, please, please do very important because he got um, some of that right up his nostrils oh, yes uh -huh. no don't rub it in don't, no yeah no you don't want that on okay. you Orax. you oh. heal seven no stuff. No stuffs. Oh. I can't smell it anymore. Okay, you're welcome. You're welcome. Well done. Oh, thank you. I liked it. Uh oh, all right. Oh. It's fine. So, I'm losing to sense each of smell own. anyway. I thought <laughs> all the stuff you're doing to me, having can't quite. We keep men in black in your nose. Yeah. <laughs> He's like a dog. He like he wants to smell not like a dog, so he like covers himself in stain. Yeah. And then you just keep giving him a bath, and he's like, "No, you're ruining it." Must go I mean, roll in something. It's essential oils for a reason. Yeah. <laughs> so having defeated the ooze and also healing his his nose, you feel yourself. You feel like you've accomplished quite mm. a bit. You feel, you feel like yeah. you're ready to take the next step. I think yeah, we I need more bubbly to celebrate <laughs> this victory. <laughs> And yes, you, you do need to officially it. level up. Oh! 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 oh. 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 To leveling oh. up. Oh, to leveling up. Oh. Uh, I think that means that I get a new haircut. Yeah. Which means everyone levels up because of it. Wait. What? Wait, so you. Ooh. Loopy Bob 2. Loopy Bob 2. Thank you. Thank I you. I was like, Bobo. So is Stuart still with us? <laughs> yes. Stuart's still with us? Yes, he is. Um, so I assume yeah. he has some uh, like Stuart. salon um, <laughs> oh, training yeah. in his Absol background. Absolutely. I, absolutely. I've, uh, oh. I, I've, I trained him as a barber. Oh, look at that. That's, well, yes, I need a, a fancy new hat. Just like a, I, I, I imagine for you, maybe a little something off the top to accentuate oh. the ears. Um, mm. I'm just Show saying more of an ears. updo. Uh, because. Because. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, that would be wonderful. Oh, uh, yes. Uh, uh, let's get out of uh, here. Uh, like, no, no, you know what? No, it's fine. Uh, can you just hold this mirror? <laughs> oh, all right. I want to integrate what's left of the ooze, though. Oh, all right. Yeah. Uh, very, very good job there. Ask right. it your questions yeah. while she gets all <laughs> fancy, uh, uh, yes, dude. Yes, all right. Mm -hmm. All right, listen, ooze. I don't know what you're trying to perpetrate against this kingdom, but we have you. We know it. And, and, and nothing you can do can stop what's happening between the love of the princes of the two kingdoms that was started and it was arranged, yes, but they eventually fell in love mm -hmm. with each other. But then there was the thing, and I don't know how you imp and, and, and implicate it in this ooze, but you're, you're, you're not going to get away with it anymore. Okay? There's a, I there's a small blip. <laughs> right. Oh, oh! You've really put it in its place, Orax. Right. 
Uh, there, it's not my best work, but I think, I mean, it's, you know, under the circumstances. And, my oh, goodness. I am amazed at how marvelous you look. There's just oh, a, little light, you. a little bit of a light show. Yeah, that that's like a yes. halo of like, yeah. oh. And it levels us all up one level, and there's nothing the GM can do about it, because ah. that's what happens at level 17 when ah. you're a gentleman. Yes. You get a new haircut, and everyone else levels up, mm -hmm. which puts me at level 20. <laughs> yeah. mm. Oh. So as I gaze at her haircut, I start to glow from within and I go, no, no, wait, Ooh. it's not time yet, hold oh, no. on. And with a, with a supreme force of effort, I begin to, to quench my glow, but I'm oh. sweating. I'm like, no, there's, there's still one thing I have to do. Oh. It's not quite time to ascend. Oh. So even though I'm level 20 now, I want to try and voluntarily hold off yes. on ascending. Okay. I feel like <sighs> you, you have the mental wherewithal to, mm -hmm. to hold mm -hmm. it in. Are you all right? <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'm fine. <clears throat> you look a little... No, you'll look know when you're... You look a little glowy. You'll know when you're older. Hold on. Yeah. Oh, okay. Do I still look glowy? Uh, I mean... It's a little... It's no, less. Of, um, it's a little more <laughs> constipated than glowy Good. now. Yes. Good. That's what I'm aiming yes. for. Oh, thank you. A, a, a new snippoo uh, Yes. Thank you for the... Thank, <laughs> thank you, Paul. Thank you for the that tips. tip. And, and with tips like that uh, and and uh, BK and Hans, like you. Uh, we unlock tier six, which is more rerolls. <gasps> rerolls. Re Thank you. Thank you very much. Three, yes. more. three more. Three more. Appreciate that. Uh, so, so you, you have defeated this ooze, and I'm voluntarily suppressing. Voluntarily suppressing. Uh, there was a voice down the the tunnel, earlier, that caused you to come down here. <gasps> oh yes, right. That's why we're here. Oh yes. <laughs> uh, voice, are you are you still here? I mean, yeah, I don't uh, uh, no. oh, no. know. I think the voice is still here. Before he, he said, said yes. Yeah. He said yes. Right. Mm -hmm. See, mm. I thought it was the ooze. Clearly it wasn't, but but very good attempt, but yeah. very good try. Excellent interrogation. Yeah, it makes Absolutely. sense that you would assume that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I already learned interrogation, so it's something that I can't apply to today. It's um, always good to apply past lessons to the present. Yes. Oh, that's something I learned. Yes. Oh, well. Yep. <laughs> to learning, right? We know what that sound means. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Oh. To learning in the application of previous learning. Mm -hmm. Who else needs public? I, I do. do. I think everyone does. Yes. We're all running low. One at a time. <clears throat> all right, let's investigate this voice. Yes. All right, so so you head further down. Thank you for the sound. Oh, 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 thank you. Uh, and uh, the closer you get, you hear a voice go, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, I would turn back. I'm. Uh, it's super dangerous. I wouldn't go any further. There's certainly, like, all kinds of traps and... Um, Gabe, Gabe, Gabe P. P. Thank, thank you for, for the, the 25. 25. Thank you for the tip. Gabe P. We appreciate um, that. Oh yes, that seems uh, definitely, familiar. Definitely super dangerous. I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't come down here at all. Hold on. I want a sense motive. Okay. Mm. Uh, Good call. Yes. We need to know what this. Is he telling the truth about to... super danger? Go for it. Harold is snoring up a storm. So loud. I rolled a twenty-eight. Uh, he, no, he's he's lying to try and keep you away. <laughs> hmm. My keen senses are telling me that there isn't super danger down this way. No. Well, there may be, because we unlocked tier seven, which is gentlemanly pug. Oh, Ooh. no. And he's like, what? We can, that what? Means, what? What did I do? What did I do? <laughs> it's time to activate the Herald Cam. Yes, Herald Cam. Cam. Can you close that, that one drawer that's... Nothing is there more gentlemanly on a Valentine's Day or Little Crimson Herald. Day do-over. Oh, yeah. yes. Then, Bubbly or X. Oh. Then the moving picture. Of a sleepy pug <laughs> wearing a bow tie. Wearing a bow tie. <laughs> Isn't that right? Well done, pug. Yeah. He's it'll it. it'll do, hold. pug. He's, Herald? he's just staring at us. Yeah, he's like... Mm. Well, I would like to make a bluff check, please. Ooh. Okay. <clears throat> hold for pug cam. Yeah, we gotta wait for this pug cam. Ooh, that's mm. a really good bluff check. Mm. So uh, that brings me to a... 33. Okay, mm -hmm. what are you trying to say? Um, <laughs> also, also gave me. Thank, Thank you for the five. <laughs> Don't worry, we've already disarmed all of the traps. We're just down here because uh, we uh, believe in true love, and we believe that you've also been subjected to some not quite true love. Uh, yeah. We're just here to make your heart happy. Oh, jeez. Uh, please, uh, please don't hurt Sislak. 
Please, you know. Sislak, we're not here to hurt you. We love you. Ugh. Is he referring to himself in the third person? He is. Yes. He I'm is. just. I'm Paul just. Nielsen. Please, please. You know, it's fine. You could just turn away. There's no need to to come all uh, attack all Sislak. Just a just a, a gad about town. You know, you don't gotta. Uh, How dare you, sir? Oh yes. Huh. By reputation, I know you n- to Wait. be no gad about. Boring gold Tyler. <laughs> Boring gold Thank you. Tyler. Hey. Oh, he's that guy who bores for gold. Yes. <laughs> if I know one thing about gadabouts, it's that they love, <laughs> that they love the finer things. That's true. Oh yes. Yes. Would Sislak perhaps like to join us? For a whistling or some contest? Bubbly? <gasps> oh, because we yes. unlocked uh, tier eight, which is a whistling contest. <laughs> okay. Now there is. Who, there, who decided this? There is a melody. There is a tune. I've hurt myself. A very specific melodic tune mm. that can unlock the very secrets mm. of the universe itself. <laughs> and whichever one of us can whistle this tune, the best wins a fabulous prize. Oh, hmm. my! So I think it will be me. Who would like to go first? Uh, after you. Oh, no. No, no, after, after you. you. No, no, please, no, after, no, after, you. No, after you. I mean, after you. Well, well, perhaps, no, should we let the GM's person go first? Oh, yes, yes, I think uh. so. Do you know the tune we speak of? I believe I, I, I know of this ancient tomb, but my mouth is so dry. And my <laughs> oh, don't worry. Is so There's some bubbly. bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> Wet your whistle, literally. Ah, yes. The saying comes from somewhere. Mm. Oh, unclassical. Thank you for the sub. We appreciate that. Despite um, your lack of the classics. Yes. yes. Well, uh, I've never been great at whistling, but I oh, believe okay. it, it's somewhere in the vein of. <laughs> Pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's basically All right. Yes. That's, that's the new bar that's been set. <laughs> okay. Hmm? 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 Oh. You. No, oh. oh, let me also. Yeah, let's all wet our whistles wet now. My, my, wet my whistle. <laughs> All right. Literally. Wow. Oh, All right. I'm sorry. She annihilated. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> New bar set. Yes. New bar. We can pull it back and I'll try. Yo, you're going to try? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I notoriously am really good at this. Put your lips together and then blow. Yeah. yeah. Overlord of Thank you for the Thank you for the sound. <laughs> One more time for the people in the cheap seats. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing. You can't spell laughter without spot. Oh, yes, that's it's right. one of those. That's what I'm missing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Damn so it. next bar has been set. <laughs> wow, you haven't really made a sound yet. <laughs> Pretty good. It's like the X Files all over again. Are you. <laughs> There, there's it was a little almost there. Sound. Yeah. I, I don't think <laughs> it's gonna happen. <laughs> You're trying so hard. I think this is the most we've ever broken, Megan. Yeah. You're, pour, you're pulling a real orax right now. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Wait. She's just trying so hard. Oh. Okay. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Went a little bit internal whistle there, but hey, any part in a storm. Sometimes those are the only ones. Yeah. I yeah, you know what? No judgment. I right? think that um, that was real close. Yeah. Was Listen, good. that's going to be hard to beat. I and, know. Uh, I now apologize. There's, there's a lot riding on me because mm-hmm. if I screw this up, I'm going to look like a real jerk for giving you such a hard time for doing it. Embarrassing. There you that's go. Pretty that's good. Solid. That was pretty dang good. No, no, you had your turn. <laughs> <laughs> I usually find like one note. Not today. An orax? <clears throat> Oh. oh! Whoa! Whoa! Okay. That was pretty good. Now, now listen. For me, it's between Kelsey and Dom. Yeah. Yeah. But I have to say. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Keep trying. But I have to <laughs> say. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got to suck one of them in. <laughs> I think Never that. Never suck a whistle in. <laughs> for those of us who clearly lost. Yeah. Um. I, I don't know. For me, I feel like Dom's confidence level yeah, going into that yes, really sold me. a lot of. Yeah. Yeah. He was trying yeah. really hard. He was, well, yeah. actually, no, he actually yeah. didn't try yeah. that hard. No, I had to make like a silly face, yeah. which I think puts me slightly below Dom's effortless the whistle. So I think Effort, effortless is this whistle. Though we may be gentle's people at the table, mm-hmm. or in the game rather, mm. at the table. There's only one of us that has the confidence to sell the most whistled tune yeah. in the universe. Mm. 
And I think that's Mr. Dump. You know what? Yeah. I think that. Uh, I think that calls for a celebration. I, I think, think so too. I think this time we should have straws, though. Oh yes. Oh, oh. yes for yes. our bubbly. Yes for our bubbly. It's very what? important what? that we have this. What? Um, uh, we brought straws for for uh, three of you. The gentle. <laughs> For uh, the gentles people. The gentles oh. people. Yes, uh, um, a, lesser person's, a lesser person's face would implode with the vacuum force that is required <laughs> uh, to suck uh, things through the straw. the straw. <laughs> and one for, for Orax. Yeah. But uh, uh, apologies, uh, apologies uh, GM, we did not do you, but yes. That's fine. Um, you might so you, you take the to, wrapper off yeah, first. Yeah, then first. There you go. Yeah. He's, now you've learned four things today. You earned it with your whistling. <laughs> so well done. <laughs> ah! Yes. Brilliant. <laughs> this is the best way to drink bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only way. Just shoot it straight to the back of your throat. <laughs> You're guaranteed not to choke on bubbles. Well, thank you very much to uh, to those <coughs> those of you, you you gentles, <clears throat> you lovers in yeah. chat for unlocking yes. wonderful that. gentle people. And don't forget all subs and tipsters. Unfortunately, no bits are entered into the giveaways, which we will go through at the end of the stream, um, after the stream, so that we can calculate everything. And we'll contact everyone via Twitch. Uh, so, uh, yeah, if you if you tipped or subbed in, we will be contacting you shortly. You must be a U.S. resident, though, to win. I'm sorry if you're watching from somewhere else. You are awesome. But unfortunately, we can't send you things. But you're yeah. still great. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. We appreciate it. <clears throat> Um, so anyways, I believe we were interrogating a, uh, a Sizax of some kind. Does he join us for bubbly? Uh, well, I mean, you bluffed so well. He's like, oh, jeez, okay. Uh, yeah, uh, well, how can I uh, help you? <laughs> we don't have sound on that camera, yeah, but... You important. can probably hear it from here, though. Yes, you can, yes. That adorable pug is quite a snorer. He's snoring down. Stalling well. some logs down there. <laughs> Well, all right. Uh, well, uh, yeah. Um. <laughs> Luna, his nervous exclamations are making me nervous. Yeah, yeah. What do we want? With oh, the I'm very sorry, Sizlak. Um, so we wanted to discuss. Uh, who who is this again? Well, this <laughs> so is the, much has happened. This is yes. that fiendish this is individual fiend. who was firing the arrows. Oh, that's right. Or at least allegedly mm. firing the arrows. So tell me, Sislak, what uh, what were you doing earlier today before you came down here to this quaint little sewer? Uh -huh. I, I mean, the I um, comes down here pretty good. I, I yeah, I mean, I was I'm staying in here. Uh, it's it's safer sometimes. Um, you know, sometimes you do a job and then somebody's a like a job. What kind of job? Uh, you know, any 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 job that a, a gadabout would would take, you know. Oh, oh. Darn it, man! You're not a gadabout. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a total. Uh... Produce your license. Mm. Oh, you know, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I uh, it's uh, it's in my other. He said, "Produce your license." <laughs> yeah, he did. And I, I have intimidating glare. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, so, Sis like doesn't have a license, okay? Oh, uh, that's a thing you're not one. Thought as much. He doesn't smell like one, so. And he strikes me as no gadabout I've ever seen. Oh, yes. Are you okay? You're sweating a lot, sir. No, I'm fine. I'm just trying to keep something in. Okay. <laughs> Ears. <laughs> Sometimes I've just to guide nearby sewer ships, I let a little light out of my ears. <laughs> yeah. Listen, uh, I, I, I don't, I don't want any trouble. I'm just, you know, I got hired for a job. I, I get hired for a lot of jobs. I do a lot of things. This sure. Guy, this guy was like, take this bow and fire some arrows. So I fired some arrows. I, uh, Wait, what guy was it? Well, it's not, not, you know, not a guy. Um, he had a, uh, he's, well, it's, it's Thaddeus, you know. Me? No. Oh. No. <laughs> Because I was going to be so confused. That, that was a twist. Twins. I did not see it coming. <laughs> Neither did I. I mean, oh, who? It? it was me the whole time. <laughs> Even he didn't know. Is your name Thaddeus? Too? It is, yes. Thaddeus oh. Q. Cornflower. Oh, I, I don't know. But now he's a, well, he's kind of, kind of runs the underground here. Um, he's, is it not you? No. No. Right. Well, because he's a, he's a beholder. Mm. Oh. Probably only has one D in his name, too. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know. He's I, probably more of an, an eye being of some nature, though. Yes. Not not a beholder. He probably sees right. beauty in everything, though. Like an oh, eye beast yes. of some kind. An eye for beast. For legal reasons. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, so this, um, this, this eye beast uh, yeah. to, to, uh... I think what, I think what Sizak was doing was he was making reference to the common expression, beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Right. Yeah. Right. Yes, clearly. Who in this case is an eye beast. And he, he also cape, keeps a lot of things and he's always holding on to stuff for people. Yeah, and, yeah. and he goes like, Behold! Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. About everything. Oh, yes. Now Sorry. it all makes sense for legal reasons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, but why, wh wh did he give you a reason for, for wanting you to do this? He just, uh, he just paid me. I didn't ask questions. Uh, says like doesn't always ask questions. It, was anyone helping you? Because we did hear that there was a, a rain of arrows. I uh, just fired a whole bunch. It's, <clears throat> it's, it's actually really easy. Yeah, there's a lot of power in that bow. Wow, do you still have oh. the bow? I'd oh, love no, to see it. Oh, no, I gave it back. It, it was causing me to have all kinds of weird, weird thoughts, and it's kind of, Felt like it was driving old Sislak mad. Oh well, well maybe you can point us in the direction of this um, eye beast, Thaddeus. Oh, yes, yes. Not, not you. Yeah, we'll no. call him Thaddeus the fake guy. Okay, yeah. yes, mm -hmm. the, uh, Thaddeus the okay. fake guy. Yeah. Ah, oh, the guy who beholds a lot of things. Yes, yeah, clearly yeah. beholds a lot of things. I'm going to call him Baddius because he's the Ooh. bad Thaddeus. Oh, I, like I like that, that better. Yes, Can I change it to Baddius? Yeah. I think yes. I I don't want to. Yeah, yeah. I want to do with that thing. Yeah. Where is this Baddius? I'm yes. going to call him Gary. Okay. Okay. Right, that's that, your prerogative, that's Orax. I mean, that's... These are all. Oh, okay. Hey, uh, Gary. Yeah. I, 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 I'll, <laughs> oh, I'll sis like and and take you take you over there. Uh, you know, as long as, as long as you, you let old sis like go after you get there. Oh well, as long as you stop uh, claiming to be a gadabout, then. then oh yeah, I, yeah. I promise. I, I, you, you find folks. I'll never tell anyone. I, I did no gad and. Okay. Good. <laughs> <laughs> and then the light shoots out of my nose. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, you got the. Uh, you see, you're all right. Wait, I'm wait, fine. Is this uh, something to look forward to? No, it's to, fine. Right? I just, it's a little bit of a light bleed. Uh, hmm. I didn't know that okay. that was so common. Yeah, I Apparently, I still have plenty to learn. Yeah, it's more of a gnome thing. Oh, okay. Well, then. Yeah, so you have this to look forward to. Okay, yes, noted. You noted. Do. I don't have to as an elf, so that's, that's lovely. I think it's tough. <laughs> <laughs> He leads you down to eventually, like through the sewers, and uh, it gets into sort of cavey systems and uh, very dark underground systems, and eventually leads you to a, a large cave opening where there's uh, a, a lot of different, um, the, like magical items, uh, creatures uh, in cages, and in the center of this is is a very large cage that has a, ch a small cherub in it. Oh, <gasps> how adorable! Oh, hello. Oh. oh. You here in the darkness. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, Cherub oh. has a much lower voice than I assumed. Was that you, Cherub, that spoke? No, that's that. That's that. That's Baddius. Oh, oh, it's already oh, catching no. on. It's so fast. That's wonderful. Hello. It's because of my BA in marketing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, well done with that. Yes. Um, what say we all turn slowly around and discover who's speaking to us? <laughs> okay, yes, I like that. Turn around and you see. Wait, hold on. Should we toast first? Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> To, uh, to shadowy greetings. Yeah, shadowy, shadowy greetings. greetings. Yes. <laughs> so you turn around and, and you see uh, some sort of uh, creature with you know, one large center eye and then more eyes open and then a few of them wink at you. Oh! oh. Uh, I can't help but return a wink. He's right on <laughs> wink. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Don't you all look so fabulous. Oh, well, well thank you. Isn't that I lovely? Mean, I mean, in a general <laughs> sense. Uh, no, we and, do. Uh, me I mean, too. I work out. <laughs> <laughs> but he does like leg day, I don't know. Uh, seems to get arms, yeah. How may I help you? Um, well, it seems that you're holding a, a, a poor little cherub here hostage and... Um, oh, yes. A winged baby. Yeah. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, I paid a pretty penny for him. Um, well, what, what is your end goal here? Um, oh, uh, t you see, <clears throat> I sell a lot of magical weapons mm -hmm. to people and uh, war is good for the selling of weapons. Oh. Uh, really, it's war? That, that was your when, when there's war, you can 
you know, if, I, if a nobleman is killed at night, you, nobody has too many questions, you know, it's a lot easier to do things that are undoors. Mm. Mm. Well, war is one thing, but you, sir, have declared war on the concept of love on this very crimson do-over day. Yes. <clears throat> love. Uh, childish. Uh, what What is love? It is a silly concept, you beings. I am above such things. I've never known love or needed it in my life. I would like to roll. Or any jello pudding pops, perhaps? <laughs> yeah. I would like to roll a perform check, if okay. I may. <clears throat> Whoa! Nat 20. I'm so nice. happy about Drop that. Drop Nat 20. So happy about that. So a 34, I want, I would like to perform a miracle of love. And I would like to make him actually strongly hold a deep held conviction that love is true and good. Can I support her perform role by performing my dance of seduction? Yes, yes please do. Are you right. gonna show your love moves? Um, I will, I will show my love moves behind her while she tries to engender the spirit of love so Okay, I rolled a, I rolled a 21. Shall I perform the dance? Yes. <laughs> Orax, drop a beat. I will uh, make an origami flower and then yeah. pull it out. Mm. Oh, yes. it glows. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> Love. It's one of the most important things sodium, in our world. Tasty sodium, tasty sodium outside. Tasty sodium outside. The beat go Orax. <laughs> No, it's Thank one of those things the where they have like the words. Eric, 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 Eric. Wicked, 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 wicked. My <laughs> word. Oh, simply. Yes. I have never known. Love. Such is Such emotions true. before. Good. Yes. Uh, sorry, life. <laughs> <laughs> that was a very loud laugh. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, I must say, I'm absolutely enchanted by your dance. <laughs> you know, you've, uh, you've cut a, quite a way yourself. Uh, mm. Thank you. I've, I, I'm trying to take care of myself. Wink, wink, wink. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. quite an accomplished do, winker as do well. Do you do curls with your arm <laughs> tentacles, with your eye tentacles? It, they're stocks. Mm, stocks. stocks. Seems... Do you curl your stocks? <laughs> Uh, I mean, maybe a little, uh, you know, I do stock push-ups. Seems, uh... Maybe wrap one of those ankle uh, weights around a stock. <laughs> do it and while you just work. Just walk yeah, around, yeah. yeah. It's, uh, dark down here and lonely, seems. Yes. Seems like, it uh... It can be. Maybe you just lack the soft caress of someone to love you. Mm. I mean, I've never known... I've always willed myself off and from the world and stayed in, in caverns and, and dank things and tried to keep people away and push them. Badius, you can't live your life like that. Will you do me a favor? Will you wink at me once more? Yes, uh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> it wins the center. <clears throat> Jocelyn? Yes. I think I've made a decision. Oh, oh I, I think I know which decision you were referring to. You know, I've spent my life in search of that one special someone yes. to spend the rest of my life with. And while I feel that my life here may be coming to an end in some form or another, I, I had one bit of unfinished business that I'd like to attend to. <sighs> so I'm going to go down on one knee. And I'm going to produce a ring box. <sighs> And also, a box of chocolates. And also, lit candles. Some lit yes. candles. Begin appearing. <clears throat> and this bouquet of flowers. Yes. Vadius, would you do me the honor of joining me in matrimony? I would be delighted. Now I have to make a fortitude roll in order to succeed on this. And all of these things provide bonus. Can 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 someone open the gentleman uh, thing in order to see what bonuses we get for per, for presenting all of these props, all of props. at the table? Okay. Yes. Uh, a ring is Check. plus five. Plus five. Flowers are plus three. Plus three. So Late eight. candles plus three. 
Eleven. Eleven. Poetry song. I didn't have time. No. <laughs> it's all very Chocolates. sudden. Chocolates. Plus two. All right, 13. 13. 13. Music. Oh. Oh, sorry, the, just the music of the night. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Orax begins whistling. I'll give you a plus two. <laughs> all right. 15. Nice clothes. Nice clothes? Yeah. I am wearing Always. them. Plus two. Oh. 17. 17. Licensed officiant. Oh, no. Where will we get one of those down here in the sewer? Oh, wait. I'm a licensed officiant. Orax? Yes, the, the elder council before sending people out uh, makes sure that they're all licensed officiants, of which I am one. Un now, just to clarify, these are not in-game items you have to bring to the table. These are real items, and Dom Zook is <laughs> a licensed officiant. That's yes. real. I am yes. too, but I am. But, <laughs> but, we have two of them. Yeah. Oh, plus 30. So, I believe you that's... You can't officiate your own wedding, yeah, I know, though. I know. Oh, sorry. That's a plus 15 on top so, of the other. Plus 28. 28 altogether? Mm -hmm. No, it was 17 already, plus 15. Oh, I thought it was at... Plus 32. 17. Yeah, okay. 32. Plus 32. So I'm going to make a very important fortitude save. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, I hope he makes it. Oh. I rolled a 12. My fortitude bonus is a plus 15. <laughs> 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 then we add the plus 32. 32. Mm. So a lot. I rolled a lot. <laughs> I've had too much bubbly to do all of the maths. <laughs> but basically, but cider. Okay. what it breaks down to is this. The bubbles still go It's all head. the cider bubbles. <laughs> cider bubbles. Baddius, you've made me the happiest gnome in the sewers. <laughs> I don't think an eye beast has ever been so in love. <laughs> Magically, so the ring grows to the size know, of one of his stocks. Slip that on, <laughs> whichever one counts as your finger. <laughs> oh, and and now, Orax, will you perform the ceremony? I'd be honored to. Jocelyn, um, I know you Tyler, have a way with animals. Tyler, can you hit the lights, oh, yes. please? Um, do you think it, is there time for you to maybe just get a bunch of high, of like trained doves together to release oh, at the yes, end? Oh yes, of course. I, I mean, I, I have a I have a, a flock of of, <coughs> of, of doves. That's how we send messages if you need them. Oh, well, no oh, one can oh, handle them better than Josh. Yeah. Yes, I will just open my arms no like can this. Help. And like and and yes, and call to the doves, and they will all come over. Do I should I make a uh, handle animal uh, roll? I can do that real quick. Uh, <clears throat> you nailed uh, it. Thirty. <laughs> uh, yeah. And all these doves just come down and they, they flap like I'm, I'm, I do this and they, they uh, fly around in, in like a heart shape. Wow. And they just continue to do that. It's just oh, like yeah. I always yeah. dreamed it would yes. be. Yeah. Oh, well, uh, you told me your dreams, so I was prepared. We already knew. Uh, yes. Luna, would you do me the honor of giving me away? <gasps> I've never been quite so happy as I am right now. Well, I've, I've studied marriage ceremonies at length, but I admit I'm a bit jumbled in my head right now, so it seems like we're hitting all the, all the yes. beats and checking all the boxes, so let's just do this thing. Do you need a moment to no, no, compose let's, It's really important that we get this done rather quickly. <laughs> it's an elopement! Let's go, everyone! Uh, let's go! Yes. Birds? Uh, Badius. Birds. We are gathered here today to unite in holy matrimony. I'm an atheist, but it's okay. Most orcs, I, okay, never mind. Anyway. The time and place, yes, Orax. Yes, the yes. goddess Shailen uh, does not care. <laughs> <laughs> Thaddeus Q. Cornflower. And Thaddeus. Uh, it's Badius, no. Mm, Badius. It caught on in a big way. way. <laughs> yeah. We're gathered I mean, here with friends and <clears throat> colleagues, I guess. I don't know the cherub. Anyway, uh, uh, so uh, I believe, um, do you, Thaddeus Q. Cornflower, take Badius to be your lawfully wedded monster? I do. Do you, Badius, take Thaddeus Q. Cornflower to be your lawfully wedded... I'm a gnome. No. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, by the power vested in me, by nothing holy or eternal, I now pronounce you gnome and monster. Oh, let's oh, toast. 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 toast! Toast! You toast. may kiss the eye beast. Uh, 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 
Well, <laughs> I can't quite reach you from here, but fine. I apologize for being in the way. Now that we have that taken care of, um, all right, lights. I would like to do something dumb. Oh, oh all right. Yes. Okay. And uh, now all of the little cracks uh, of light coming through maybe the the broken brick of the sewer. Um, are like multi prism colored and it looks like a well there's a lot of uh, there's a lot oh. of gemstones that are in there yes. so the light actually hits them and then yes. like the prisms out into yep. wonderful colors so now we have like disco ball in the sewer <gasps> oh isn't that lovely magical oh yes mm. <laughs> meant to be for the after party oh yes oh yeah well, it's time to party oh but first oh We've that dreadful business mm. with everyone oh. being in love with the wrong mm. person. Oh, right, right, right. Not a problem. I will simply let the Cupid go and he'll reverse all the things. Everyone will go oh, back he'll to just take care of it. Oh, what? We don't need to actually do anything. The, the, the cherub will just fix all yeah. of the. Oh! <laughs> I, I mean, all right, I'll let you out. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Hey, oh, that was very scary. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't have a key or anything. Okay, yeah, start, no, it was just it. frightening. Seeing Faux uh, Hammer flying for this very small well, cherub. Well, Thank that's you not for a hammer, that's a hammer. Hey, oh. hey, <laughs> you guys are wonderful ambassadors of love. I, I appreciate it. Oh, let me grab my bow. Uh, I off to go fix all of their issues. Oh, oh. go go with grace, Cupid. My heart swells today. Yes. It's, it's always wonderful to see love form naturally. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I like him. Oh, yes, he's lovely. He's it smells lovely. like baby powder. <laughs> oh, no, I like oh, yes. It. I like it, I that fresh too. scent. It's very good. I don't. Well. It's hard for me. It's the only thing I can smell. Orax. Or do you? Mm-hmm, yes. No, I don't. I don't all right, know. well, okay. Okay. it's worth it. It's all right. Yeah, we had, to, mm -hmm. we had to check. Should we check on the prince? Maybe we should, but... We should. But are you all right? I think, um... You do look a little um Well now that I've glowy again. Now that but I don't think that's the glow of love. I think this is something different. <laughs> now that I found true love, I, I feel that my gentleman's my gentleman's purpose here on this plane has ended. I think it's time for me to ascend to the next level of existence. Oh Badius, will you join me on this journey? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so I grab one of his eye stalks. <laughs> And I start to glow from within mm. and float above the ground, kind of like at the end of Beauty and the Beast. Yes, that's oh. exactly what this is. <clears throat> I was thinking like Super Saiyan. Well, you know. No, no, different Don't than that. Yeah. Uh, I become suffused with light and it starts to shoot out of my fingertips and eyes and ears and whatnot. That's and different. now, now that's I lose all okay, ability sure points. <laughs> oh my. I lose all, all stats and abilities. Oh my goodness. Now I just, I'm a being of pure energy that can ask privately of the GM if it's cool if I make whatever I want blow up. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Can we see the being of pure energy? The... Yeah. Yeah. Can you show us that? Oh, I. You can't see it. Oh, oh, that, oh. Okay. Wait, wait, hold on. He's doing May I? It now? <laughs> this. Oh, there we go. How about now? Do you see it? Yeah. It's kind of. It's like an yeah. uplight kind of thing. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's oh, a yes. soft focus. Yeah. Go, <laughs> go now and leave, oh. Badius and I. Oh, wait, hold on. Sorry, just still getting used to this. It's new. <laughs> leave, leave, Badius and I to our energy bean bliss. Go and 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 save the prince, and you know, keep carrying on the gentle person's code. You two are ready. I mean, and Orax, I'm almost ready. I think probably close to quite. You just keep on trucking, buddy. <laughs> oh, it's the nicest thing and everyone's ever said to me. <clears throat> Shall we, Badius? <laughs> <Yes>. Pissew! <laughs> and you see this like, like little, like, like it's just like glitter, land, like slowly float into the ground where they were. Huh. Well. Should we let the other It looks like out? I need a refill and since Thaddeus oh. is in oh. pure energy form, that <laughs> responsibility goes to you. Oh, I Drop suppose it does. on the floor. It's fine. One last hoorah. Ah, use your hands while you have them. Because of course, we have to celebrate yes. Thaddeus's <laughs> ascension to being a be being of pure energy and life. Oh course. yes, very important. It only happens once. There we are. So the, the rest of you uh, make your way out of the sewers. 
Uh, and I assume you wanted to head to the prince first? Yes. Uh, you noticed that uh, on your way there, uh, the, the orc that was uh, bemoaning his, his lost love is sort of like shaking his head and like just kind of walking away and like doesn't kind of just like, uh, and like, um, that was so strange. And then uh, when you get to the tower, you see the, the prince is just like, uh, such a f fool, uh, what did I? Uh, he gave me such a great horse and I was ready to throw that away. Was almost very foolish. But the good news is everything is back to normal now and now you can marry your betrothed, your true love. Oh, exactly. Yes. He throws out m one more uh, clown painting out the window. Oh, oh my gosh, it's so <laughs> nice in here now. There's yes. still a few in there, but like there's, it, it, there's two less now. Mm. Mm. And better. two less clown paintings it's is the a right lot amount. Better. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I think I, I don't know what happened, what came over me, but I just, I just realized that I can't. You know, I mean, I know I like originally I was, I was upset because it was, you know, it was for, it's for my dad, and I was that's the only reason why we were getting married. But now I'm realizing that it's like, you know, I really love, I really love him. You know. As you should. Yes. That's that's a, this is a wonderful end to this story. I think. <laughs> You actually get to be with the one you love. Yeah, you know, it's Crimson's a do-over, right? Yes. yes. Let's get this party going. Oh yes, I like this. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so you guys celebrate. Wiki, 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 wiki. You celebrate in the tower, more, but as you leave, more disco ball. Life. More, more and more people are in the square. You see, it's just a, a very impromptu Crimson Day do-over <laughs> celebration. Everyone cheering and like, and the festivities kick off. There's food. There's, there's, uh, you know, people are in love and falling in love. You notice. The, the stable master who, uh, who uh, or the, the, the janitor who, who you oh. uh, talked to earlier, yeah. he's, he's got his arm around a girl now. Whoa. <laughs> I look up, I look down from another plane of existence and go, a boy. Yeah. I would like to activate, I'm on a horse. Yeah. Mm. And I would like to then, as a horse has appeared underneath me, ride through the square, throwing <laughs> rose petals on everyone. Yes. Absolutely. She's learning so well. <laughs> She's on a horse. Yeah. I am on a horse. <laughs> and the celebrations go off. You, you spread the rose petals. It just it becomes a, a, a tremendous festival of love. Now, everyone now celebrates Crimson Day on the second day. Now, instead mm. of the original Crimson right. Day, they celebrate Crimson Day do-over yes. uh, from here on true out. True Crimson Day. Yeah, the, the true Crimson Day has moved mm. to the 15th. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's yes. funny. It matches right up with... Oh, yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Huh. Very interesting. Weird. Yeah. <laughs> so, thank you guys. You've you've saved love. You've saved Crimson Day, and you've done a brilliant thing. And you've done it as the best gentle people you can. Yes. Right. Yes, we did. And yes. also Orax. And also Orax. And also Orax. And also Orax. It's me. <laughs> Oh, Harold's oh. awake. Oh, oh the gentle Harold, pug has awakened. Harold, moving outside of camera range. Harold! Harold, they can just see your patoot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. He's coming oh, down, there we don't go. worry. There there we go. Go. Just needed right. a good stretch. Right. Yep, just got just a stretch, and then, man, that stretch and sure tired me out. <laughs> yeah, time for a nap. <laughs> Well, thank uh, you guys so much for, for watching. Thank you. Yay. Thank you, Eric, thank for you. doing thank this. Yeah. Thank you, Eric. Eric. Thank you guys. Uh, uh, thanks to Old Spies who, <laughs> yeah. who, who heard about us uh, doing this and overnighted this huge care package of, of uh, Old Spice stuff. So Give thank away. you. Yeah. Thank you very much, Old Spice. Um, so yeah, this is the gentleman class. Uh, if you hit exclamation point Old Spice, uh, it will send you the link. Uh, yeah, I it's mean, a PDF. it's fun. It's like it's one a PDF, of it's yeah. one of like it's very like bard esque. Very yeah. bard esque. Yeah. Um, yeah. Lot of joke abilities, yes. but also a lot of surprisingly <laughs> functional abilities yes, as yeah. well. Actually, there's a few things we didn't get a chance to uh, to, to yeah. do and explore. Yes. Um, so we all talked about having a bachelor's in marketing, right? But that allows you to sell items for fifteen percent more than the market mm -hmm. value. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty cool. Um, also, none of us ever turned into a wolf dog. No. Right. Um, but you can do that once per day, and it has all of the abilities of a wolf, but it can talk and ace any difficult business situation. <laughs> However, you cannot change back from your wolf dog form until you've been reduced to zero hit points. Yes. So that's one reason why we didn't do that. It just didn't, it didn't seem like the time was right. Yep. Yes. Yeah. And then as a level 19 gentles person, for most of the game, I had just gotten my MBA. Mm -hmm. Uh, which allowed me to solve complex organizational management problems. <laughs> yeah, 
You did that nice. real well, I think. Thanks so much. <laughs> Blind Seer, thank you for the tip. Thank you, Blind Seer. Thank you, Blind Seer. Uh, so yeah, so I don't know if you want to dump this into your game, like absolutely go go for it. It it definitely takes the place of a bard, I think, yeah. <laughs> in, in many ways. But they're better fighters than bards. Yeah. They're better fighters than yeah. bards. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. It might be might work out better for for you. Surprisingly <laughs> capable. I yeah. recommend having bubbly for your game. Right. Yes. Yeah. At all times. Yeah. yeah it's very important. Or it? just Martinelli's sparkling sort <laughs> Dom, will you stop ruining this for us? <laughs> it's bubbly. Uh, all right. Well, thank you guys for tuning in. Let's go around and you can just tell people where they might see you again, starting with uh, Oryx himself, Dom Zook. Oh, hi, guys. Um, <laughs> Dom Zook. So you can see me uh, Friday nights on our Wildcard show. It's a Deadlands Reloaded show, GM'd by uh, Jordan Caves Kellerman and also with Megan Caves and Garav Gulati. Uh, and Jordan Pridgen are all in that show. It's a lot of fun. Friday nights at 8 o'clock Pacific. So I hope you can tune in for that. And uh, we have tons of stuff, but other people are in that stuff, so they'll talk about it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, guys. Kelsey Osborne. You can follow me at Kelsey Kelsum on both Twitter and Instagram. Um, you can catch me. We only have one more show left, but you can catch me on Tuesday nights at 8 p.m. Pacific on Black Bag Detectives. Our season and series, series finale. finale. It's the last yeah. show of Black Bag on Saving Throw. It's going to be next week. So tune in. There's going to be probably some pretty crazy stuff that happens. Most likely. Um, yeah. In the future, I'm going to be on um, a gaming podcast. So follow my social medias for uh, updates on that. Ooh. Oh, me. Hi. I'm Megan Caves. You can find me on Twitter at Megan Caves, it's spelled M-E-G-H-A-N-C-A-V-E-S, and on other things I'm Batcave63. Um, and uh, yes, you can find me on Wild Cards on Fridays, and you can find me and Eric tonight on Iron Keep, which is our D&D show at 8 p.m., so Wednesday is 8 p.m. Uh, we are doing the Barrier Peaks right now, but it's 5 E, so pretty interesting. Expedition to mm. the Barrier oh. Peaks. <laughs> and then Jordan and me and Garav have an RPG podcast where we talk about GM stuff called Experience Pointers. Uh, if you back uh, Saving Throw here on Patreon, $10 and up, you get that uh, our episodes a week early. So come out on Tuesday, every other Tuesday, you get it a Tuesday before. And you can follow us on Twitter at EXP Pointers Pod. Uh, everyone took a lot of the stuff that I was going to say, but I will <laughs> say you can follow me on Twitter at Jordan Callerman. And also, please do tune in for Wild Cards on Friday night at 8 p.m. This show was a lot of fun and very silly. Wild yeah. Cards is also fun, but not as silly. We try and dive a little deeper into the spooky, weird, grittiness of the West. Yes. Although, we still do get silly we from time to time. <laughs> we can't but help it. Check it out. Why not? Yes. <laughs> and while, uh, as we... As Megan said, uh, I'm also on uh, on uh, the Iron Keep Chronicles here Wednesdays at eight, uh, and it's not this silly, but it can get silly. Yeah, it gets pretty silly. Yeah, it Absolutely. gets a little silly. Uh, but thank you guys for for tuning in, for donating, uh, for all the tips, the bits, uh, the subs. Those are all yes. really great. Yeah, thank, uh, you. Really yes, thank you. Really appreciate it. Thank you guys. Thank you to all the new faces. Yeah, all, yes. the, all the great yeah, new faces. Everyone. And uh, yeah, thank you, thank you for, for tuning in and enjoying this. Uh, this is just a fun thing we threw together, and uh, we have shows all throughout the week. You can hit yeah. uh, exclamation point calendar, and it'll show you all of the the shows we have. We have uh, six days a week, mm -hmm. six yeah. days a week, six a whole week. bunch of shows. Uh, it's probably definitely something that you are into. We're probably running it, so just check it out. And mm -hmm. and, and thank you for tuning in. And, and thank you to Tyler for yeah. running things yeah. behind the scenes. Yay. And you guys might have seen his brief on-screen appearance earlier, but Tyler is also wearing a suit he today. Is. Yes. Yeah. All kinds of fancy. Tyler there. is just as fancy as the rest of us are, so thank you, Tyler. Yes. Yes. And thank you all for tuning in. And Yay. I guess uh, we'll see you all some other time. But oh, we'll see you later tonight. Yeah, when yeah, are we doing yeah, the yeah, giveaways? Yeah, are oh, we yeah. announcing that stuff? Right after this, we'll, right go, after we'll this. go through all the everyone who subbed and tipped and uh, resubbed or whatever, and we'll go through all the names. We will randomly select uh, names from from those uh, who who tipped and everything, and then we will contact you through Twitch to uh, get uh, your address. Uh, again, it's U.S. residents only, so I apologize if we reach out to you and you're not a U.S. resident, but we'll... we'll we love you we'll a love little you. bit more, but we send you a little bit less. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah. It all balances out. Yeah, okay. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye. Oh, yeah. Bye. Oh, yeah. Toast to Valentine's Day.